All right, right. so... We last left off, if I recall, as the Inquisitor, the new one, was telling you about the special object they need to retrieve, the cylinder, uh, from this vessel. There's a uh, Chaos Space Marines that infiltrate the vehicle. Hey, is Norse going to join us, Tesseract, or Yelmuk? Or is it Tesseract, your friend? Uh, I don't believe so. Okay, cool, because I, I had a storyline for bringing him into the game, but anyways, cool. Um. But if, if, he is, he if, he is, if he is joining, he ha he's not joining yet. Definitely not this session. From right. what I gather. Fine. Fine. So, you guys get to the Thunderhawk. You got your crew tells you they see the vessel in sight and they're going to land. It seems very dark and dead. Like it's been very derelict. They land on the hangar. You guys are just made your way in the first level. To the dead hanger. Can you see the screen? You guys can see upper yep. corner. Okay. Yeah, top left. Are you guys gonna be listening for any sounds? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay. Uh, was awareness check? Alrighty. Modifier. Uh, plus 20. Okay. Uh, everyone who succeeds, you hear chatter over here. It would be like space chatter, to that, to that, but like more deep, demonic. But you definitely know it's space. I'm going to just stand in front of everyone, just, just kind of raising my shield up. Waiting for others to do their thing. All right, you guys gonna do a stealthy approach? You guys gonna go hot? Try it? It's over there. I say we do stealth because we have the element of surprise right now. I guess I could roll for that. Sure. Silent move, was it? Yep. Modifier? Minus 20? Okay, you are... Around. Right. You're gonna hear that chattering stop. You guys hear conk, conk, conk coming down the hallway. Yeah. And I realize uh, because my character sees like a foot over here. Uh, I like relay the information that there's like a contact right there. You try to. Hmm. Gaze gonna open fire on them. Easy to do. I'm gonna scoot right here. And I guess I'll shoot him. Okay. We are on the the mission zone area, right? We're not like somewhere else. Yeah. No, you're in the mission. You're in the the space Hulk. All right. Yeah. Space yeah. Hulk. Yeah. So there was no. There was between uh, where you guys departed. Where you guys landed, there was nothing to interrupt the two. There's a giant space hulk over a uh, planet. Life flip. <laughs> and no apparent gunfire came in as you guys were landing. Uh, you didn't see any other vehicles as you came in. Uh, your crew did notice uh, drop pod holes in the side of this thing. Like that smash into it. But that's about the only thing of note. Uh, alrighty. And then you, your character would have been informed of all that, so. Okay. Make your attack. Uh, 
Do your damage. Oh, I'm trying to remember how this works. That's three hits. Yeah, yeah the first storm one. boulder. Uh, is that a stone boulder, right? Yeah, it's a storm boulder. I think it's plus. So it's going to be four so it's, hits. I think. It's six. No, I think it's it's, it's two each. It's uh, you get one for zero, and then one for two, and then one for three, right? Or is it plus one for every? It's like plus two to your degrees of success. Uh, like how the storm sorry, this is this is works. automatic. Oh, it's automatic. Uh, I think then it's plus one to your uh, degrees of success. So it's one for every hits. degree, then. Yeah. Uh, so it's that should be, be six then. Three, in, because like you wrote zero minus zero point two on your second one, so that's the miss. And on your first one, you wrote two point six, and you add plus one, and that's going to be three in total. If that's yeah. automatic fire. Yeah. So storm boulder fires two each. That's six. Oh, uh, that's a storm boulder. Yeah. So. Uh... Sure. Okay, so where do the, where do they hit? That's the question. Because uh, he has twenty nine on the arms. Zero 24. six. Is that head? That's twenty four. Yep. Twenty four on head. Twenty four on leg. Okay. Would you consider these guys heretics? Yes, they're chaos space marines. Absolutely. Alrighty then. They could have just weapons. been regular space marines. Uh, well, there is no, there's no other space group that you guys are aware of that's on this vessel. It is a space Hulk. And we have uh, informed well. there are a chaos space marines on this vessel as well. Right, and you, you yeah. were informed everything must die. I didn't roll below a three on any of the damage numbers, so there's no need to be rolling. And these yeah. weapons count as holy for the purposes of whatever that means. The the, 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 the thing. Wait, didn't you bring armor to bypass bullshit, or is that entities? Um, okay. Uh, do these guys have a psychic rating? No. Then they would do nothing. Aside from normal stuff. 29 in the arms, uh, 44 in the center, 24 legs, and head. Mm -hmm. Their armor class. Oh, uh, zero 06 is a headshot, right? Yes. So. 24, so how much gets through? Uh, 25, um, like, uh, so it's one damage, I guess. Only you, okay, one gets through, all right. Any more 25s? Any more? Nope. Oh, you have pin four, dupe. Yeah, pin four, so. Okay, so. Should be anything with 21? Anything over 21. So. One damage, four damage. Five total. All right, cool. I got that. Anyone else going to do a surprise attack? Uh, I'll spend my turn to invocate. Hey, okay. surprise action. I'll move slightly up here to cover yeah, invocate. Him. All right. I'm and... gonna go ahead and fire off my bolter in full auto. Can you hit them from there? Actually, let's see. That's a good question. This is a wall. Oh this yeah. Is this, this is this is There's a, wall. a wall. Okay, you I'm gonna move, to so I'm not. Are, are you sure your attack? Okay, I'm not gonna not attack. I'm just gonna move this turn. Oh. How about that? Okay. There we go. Okay. Right. Yeah, do the damage. No, I so I I didn't actually shoot. Oh, I'm okay. Dumbass. Okay. Uh, who else is gonna make take a pop shot? At these guys. 
Dominguez, dude. No, uh, I don't really. I can't. I can't see them. So I'm just gonna wait until they get. I get a better uh, angle. Okay, so you you could aim, I guess. Yeah, it could take turns yeah. to steady your aim. That'd be good. Yeah, I could steady aim. Is that like plus? What's the benefit with that? Like, is it plus ten? Uh, half 20? action plus ten, and a full action plus twenty. To hit. Alright, then it'll be plus twenty. Also, right. don't forget, we've all taken the oath of knowledge, and our chosen foe was Chaos Marines. So everyone okay. gets a plus 10 to weapon skill and ballistic skill when nice. fighting against Chaos Marines. Oh, dang. I should have come. Oh, oh. How much more damage do you deal then? No, that would be to it's hit. It's just to, to hit. I okay. probably would have gotten one more hit, but yeah, whatever. Yeah, well, like this attack for Neil Tyson uh, would be one extra hit then. All right. I, uh, Tyson didn't get a hit. He didn't attack. Roll for initiative. Are you done? Really? He, yeah, so. He wasn't in sight range. He was. Ah, yeah, okay. Gotcha. Yep. Gotcha. Or would you? 17. All right. Oh my god. Oops, I didn't select my gear. Look at my initiative roll. I well, already succeeded. 17. Hell yeah. Good day. There we go, fix. Damn, you have the fuck out of the initiative right now. Ignore the second one. Well, okay. still, you still got a really good initiative twice in a row. And Eric Hayes, you got 10? Yeah. My character is speedy, if nothing else. All right, you all see your characters on the board? Yep. Oh. So, Brasar, go. All righty. Oh, how much have I pulled again? Remember, you don't no longer have that free move. Uh, these yeah. guys are these guys are slow, you guys. Or is full move just a regular walk? Right. Yeah, full move is regular. Fourteen, rough. Oh well. They are wearing that chaotic armor, so. Okay, do your damage. Ooh, righteous fury. Yeah, one, two, three, good. Oh, there's a bit more. One sec. Yeah, don't forget you have a macro to do that better. <laughs> Possibly, yeah. It needs to be changed, I think. All right, and then just tell me the hit locations and damage. Because it, that they, it does depend. They have armor, so. Yeah, let me just... Thank uh, you for... Righteous Furies. Huh? Okay. That was the right Thank you for the uh, reminder of the macro. You're rogue. <laughs> I keep forgetting that's the that's the thing. Yeah, I, I I upgraded my weapon, so I think it needs to be changed. Let me see what needs to be changed. If anything hits chest, it's forty four. By the way, so armor, armor total. 
Tough. See, 75 and 93, that is legs. These are all leg shots. All of them? All of them. 24. So, it would be just... So, 20? Anything over 20? All right. <laughs> 18 damage total? Oh, for dead. Blew off his legs. Actually, nothing much has changed. They're just getting like plus one bonus. I think they rolled two d ten now. Yeah, Jesus! You killed a space marine. You're not a space marine. That's crazy. I guess they do roll two d ten. Anything else, Moth? Uh, nope. That's my entire turn. All right, Neil Tyson, go. All right. Uh. So. I don't see any enemies. So I'm you just do see me to... firing down this corridor, though. Yes. I'm going to fire blindly into the dark. So, mm -hmm. minus, minus uh, 30 on hitting anything. Alright. You're going to shoot down the direction of the enemy. It's also going to be plus, what, 20 because I'm full auto? An additional plus 10 because it's uh, Chaos Marines. Marines, so yeah. Right. So it's a zero roll. You you can't even hit anything, though, I don't... Well, we just can't see. We'll find um, out. <clears throat> can't see. He can shoot wall, I imagine. It's not armor uh, play. He can, he can aim at the wall here. Oh, my God. It. How bad I, was the miss? I hit jack shit. No, it's a minus five. It's okay. a 94. He almost jammed. Ugh. God damn it. Alright. That's my turn. Click. Oh, I forgot to reload. My bad. Oh, speaking of reloading. Right. So that's. Gas piece return. He's up here, and he's going to take a shot at Karnoff. You are not but a puppet brother, a pitiful lapdog blindly serving your emperor's rotting corpse while you follow orders and stale edicts, we, the children of chaos, drink from the chalice of true power and freedom. Your loyalty binds you, your faith chains you, and your emperor's golden dream blinds you. You are but a toy soldier in your decaying imperium. In the warp-touched realms of chaos, we are kings! I don't even notice the, the bolt hitting me. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> I love how he says that and then, like, wolf's on Tickles his damage. <laughs> he had... Tickles you. He got a one on his damage roll. Oh, my one. God. That's Out of all incredible. The roll, was, he, was he firing in the full <laughs> water? Uh, yeah. He's yes. at, by the way. I think got... I to do two more damage rolls for him. Okay. Good line reading, by the way. Yeah, that yeah, was good. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, that that's, that doesn't do anything. That that just tickles me. Okay, uh, Dominus, go. All right, I'm just gonna use the have the bolter against him. Yeah, so I do have aim. So that's so I have a base of plus forty. Then aim. Uh, that's plus sixty. And it's against chaos plus seventy. God and his half range is ten, right? Yes. <laughs> Ooh, plus so, 80, let's go. Plus 80. <laughs> Rolls at 100. Oh. Well, good thing I did all that. Uh oh. <laughs> this is 86. <laughs> nice. Hey, once I get to go, you'll get another plus 10 on that roll. 68 straight to the torso. Penetration is normal, right? Or uh, armored? Um, do you have any crazy ammo? 
Oh, no. I don't think so. Well, I'm not going to use it. I'll do, do normal. Oh, my God. Dead. How much damage? A lot. <laughs> 192, but... <laughs> that's over Total. five shots. Or six, seven shots. Okay. Uh, and where do they hit? That, that, that does matter. Because this guy has armor like you guys. Torso. Oh. Well, 44 on the torso. If it's all torso shots, 44 minus whatever the damage. Yeah, uh, well, no whatever damage. Is, whatever his armor is. Seven. is I imagine uh, it's probably like minus 20 on everything. It's body's thirty, but is they're natural. They have they're, they're space marines like you. He has forty four, yeah. so forty four overall. Yeah, so. plus plus space marine armor. So I imagine their defense is probably around twenty or eighteen. So you might not have killed him with that, right? Especially if they've got twenty ish wounds, and then the extra critical damage table. Yeah, I'm not going to go that balls deep with the uh, basic dudes. Just when you hit 20, they're just dead. That's, a... <laughs> That's too involved. Let's wait a system that I'm actually did that. Okay, uh, is that your you go? How much damage did you do? How much damage you got through? Not Ooh, enough. Good. Zero. Zero. I don't hit him in the chest. Uh... Wait, what? I think he did some damage. What do you mean he didn't do any damage? His armor is 44. Chest? Is his armor actually 44? Not his chest armor. Piece. Chest, this, piece. This is... chest piece is 30, and then it, with his toughness bonus, it puts a 44. That's the number I'm saying. 44, 29 in the arms, 24 in the head and legs. So uh, would... <laughs> yeah. okay. Dude, you're I, got, I got lucky with the head shot and the leg shots. I got yeah. real lucky. You're using are, an older version uh, of uh, Macro Dude, so this was the, the newer one, which basically you can uh, type in the A armor points of the enemy you're hitting, and it will automatically subtract that from the damage you do. So we can actually see the amount of damage it will do. Okay, cool. Give that to him. Yeah. But yes, they are tough bastards. So you said what? 33 for the chest? 29 for everything else? No. 44 with all his bonuses. It is, in fact, 44 to the chest. Yes. That's what looks on the sheet here. 30, it's 30 for just his armor, and then I guess with his bonuses, it makes it for, the number down below is 44. That's the number I'm using, right? Okay. Yeah, that's, that's their total. So yep. in order for him to do anything, he has to basically max his damage roll. All right. Makes sense. Nah, okay. <laughs> Yeah. For what you're up against, yes. Are these Terminators? <laughs> uh, they are very, very heavily armored guys. You guys are, yes. They're very slow, too. You only can go 14. Are, so. are they obliterators? Whatever. You just see a, you see a guy pretty bulky. Imperative mm -hmm. to uh, your guy Karnoff there. I literally have to have max damage just to give him one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Right, if you hit center torso, yes. Okay. Don't this hit center torso. <laughs> just don't hit, yeah. Don't <laughs> hit center of mass, hit everything else. Okay. God, that's but so can't you, can't you aim at specific body parts? You can. Huh? It's called cold shot, but it's a minus two aiming, something like that. Considering he had a plus eight. He has to call the, the spot he wants to target. Yeah, but that's like so a talent, I think. You need to read oh. up on the rule. Uh. Uh, let's see. Yeah, and you're fighting basically equivalent guys to you guys. I so keep. That. Well, not. Not, not, <laughs> not, not with an armor of 44. It's not equivalent at all. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I engineered them to be a challenge. Have fun. 
I think that's uh, an understatement. Have fun. <laughs> hey, he doesn't hit very hard, so that's good, right? That's good. So I could have been I, at, made him really bad, just like they're hard hitting and tanky. I end my turn, by the way. Uh, is yours 12 or 11? Why is 12? Because I had two on the thing. Uh, Eric, ladies, go. Why am I on the turn order twice? I don't know. I'll delete one. Okay. I'm going to move forward five, five meters. Yeah, cold oh, shot five? is minus 20. Well, oh, yeah. I, I need a, a half action to move. So Boom. just do headshots. Guys, I move my five. Uh, let's move a little, a little, a little further this way. All right. Um, and then I'm going to use oh. possibility shield. Uh, it's gonna be on everyone. So everyone uh, now gets that plus ten on a roll. So there's our damage bonus for at least one roll. Nice. And then that's mm -hmm. my turn. I shuffled, and I did the thing. Far enough. Go. I actually cannot. I don't, actually, no, I can make it. It's okay. Yep. All right. I don't think this guy is going to be in for a good time. I charge in. Let's see. How did I do it? Uh, I'm going to use. I'm still holding the shield, so I will still use one handed version of my weapon. Okay. Uh, that's going to be. 10, 20, Sorry, I forgot 10, 10. to actually make the willpower roll. Right, if you're mm -hmm. striking him, it's a weapon skill to parry, right? Uh, it's a weapon skill to parry, yep. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, he, doesn't need, he doesn't need to do anything. <laughs> so you're going to do faint point that, or? Yep. <laughs> yep. Uh, where was it? Heretics, yes. Uh, plus 10, plus 10, yes. I think it's like plus 40 for me or something to hit now. Yep. <laughs> Holy goddamn. But he buries it. Yep, you guys are just flashing the same leg. Yeah, he blocked with the chainsaw. That's all you see. Uh, Brasar, go. Okay. Blocks with your, his chain sword. Alrighty. Now, the degrees of success, is that... We'll have to look into that, like, with parrying. Does that counter all of it, I, or...? I, I remember looking into it. I think it doesn't, but I need to double-check. It For multiple yeah, attacks, dodging dodges, uh... Every degree of success is an extra hit dodged but i imagine parrying is the same for multiple attacks okay so it's one attack that you just did see it unblocking only one attack yeah so if you could attack uh, again he wouldn't be able to parry the second one okay because that'd be a second attack as opposed to multiple bullets got it kind of want to make it a little more interesting give you the four points of success deal whatever damage from that like where he just kind of blocked it that's just my thinking but we have that so so our go so yeah from what i'm reading it's just a just just a check it doesn't need to be better got it, it to be succeed got it that's locked it's all right it works both ways though otherwise we would have been annihilated long ago yeah and you're firing into combat, minus 20. Yep. And you are outside my possibility shield right now, so you don't get my plus 10. You don't get his blessing. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs>
All right, I'm going to try it with this anyway. It's minus 10, but it should work, I hope. Point two. Was it aimed attack? Nope. 46 is where? And 64, it's... 46 body, straight body. torso. Hey. Okay. Oh, and shit. 20. Holy fuck. Okay, so that negates. Uh, man, so, so 20, 20, 24 is negated. 24 is negated. It, it should negate 20. Right, that's so what I'm saying. 24 uh, right, damage so, is removed, so that's 11 for the torso. Damn. That hurts. Ooh, hold on. Did I roll, uh, uh, make that? I can't roll under it, so it's plus one more damage, so it should be a 36. So 12 damage. Ha! Ah, these are proven weapons. Can't roll under a three. Where did it hit? Torso. That's my time turn. Okay. And Neil Tyson, go. Ha, ah, that pitiful strike of yours, lapdog of the throne. You couldn't hit the broad side of a monolith with that. You scurry around in the shadows, thinking yourself a hero while you're merely a rat in the sewers of your crumbling Imperium. Come step into the light of chaos. Let us show you what true power feels like. I love that you made this guy sound like a rat person. <laughs> what? <laughs> rat person? A rat person. Yeah, a little. Yeah, that's, I'm thinking like uh, you're, you're doing the same thing <laughs> from... Um, what is that that game? Vermintide? Yeah. Vermintide. They oh, I don't like even... I am have no frame of reference for that. I have no idea. But in Warhammer, they, they sound like the, the Ratmen. All right. Uh, Warhammer 3, they sound like that, too. Which was, I was like, funny. I was like, ah, oh, it's Ratmen. Interesting. So, uh... I think I'm going to just move up to here. And let's see. Yeah, it's full move is 24. I, I can't, this is a good opportunity for my voice mod. Mm -hmm. For the next guy. This guy can be the rat guy. There we go. Because he did call out a shot <clears throat> and then totally wolfed on it, doing any sort of damage. Alright, I believe that is my turn. Unless is it? I can yeah. get another action. Well, I did a full move. Just trying to get closer so that I can uh, do better stuff here. Yep, I believe that is my turn done. Are you ready to parry his attack? Oh, me. Oh, yeah, you just struck him with a sword. Do you think he's just going to sit there like, oh, yeah? Parried with my chain sword, and I'm just gonna like not do anything. He can attempt to. All right. He attempted. He did attempt. All yeah. right, so that's gonna be plus thirty, I think. Overall, let me see. I just have so many talents, so <laughs> go for it. I need, I need to look for them all. Yeah, I think that's only plus very. Yep. yep. You guys are having an epic battle. 
I just kind of stand there in, with a shield up, and I'm just also like just parrying it with my sword. One hundred version variation of my sword. Oh, okay, still there. All right, the Mangus, go. Oh, uh, let's see. I'll do a run into the corner, and that'll be it. All right, the corner right here. Okay, Eric, ladies, go. All right, I'm going to uh, do the moth right here, which is exactly enough to hit him, but not uh, our black shield. So only the space marine. Would that affect him in combat? That affect him in combat, or is it just like it matter? It it's just radius. Okay. Uh, unless they're dancing around each other in combat, it doesn't matter. No, they're not. It's kind of like two big bulky guys <laughs> smacking each other with big chain sword sticks <laughs> at this point. Cool. Is what I'm, I'm imagining. Gonna this, I'm going to do this unrestricted. Cool. It succeeds. What does he have to do? It's a oh, double. God. It's a double. So I will have to roll on the table. Oh, no. Uh, it, it'll probably be fine. Yeah, hopefully. I'm going to go ahead and just roll, roll on the table now. Please do. Okay, well, I thought I rolled on it, but it didn't do anything. Did you use the faint? Oh, yeah. oh, I know why. I know why. Because it's named differently in the rollable table in the campaign. It's like, it to be the exact same name. <laughs> also, there's apparently only six out of the 25 stuff in, on the rollable table. So I can just uh, roll it for you if you want. I, I have well, a well, great I mean, table. Okay, I added, I added whatever you gave me before. I'll... Unless it deleted it or something. I know I did. I wanted that. Uh, you you, you that. need to like uh, since it's like a TXT file on Discord. You need to click on the arrow to expand the file. It will show more rows of text. Okay. Well, that's uh, my apologies then. I thought I got it all. Uh, no. It? Uh, psychic phenomena. This is the role I got for you, Leo Monk. Uh, it's not above a 75, so that's fine. And instead gets defaulted to uh, just darkness for uh, a moment. Shows up. Because uh, I have the skill, the Sanctum Psyker, so all my stuff is Veil of Darkness. If it's not mm. 75 or above. All right. So whatever... Veil of Darkness is on that chart, is what it actually does. Um, but I will now do uh, my damage onto him. Also, he needs to make... Well, first he needs to make a, uh, a, a dodge, but he can't, because he's already used his uh, reaction to parry. He right. did that last round. This is still this round. Is it? Hasn't gone my Oh, no. Hasn't. You're right. Because the black shield goes after me. Okay, I thought he went before me. Anyway, oh. uh, I need to do. Wait, no, he got attacked by the. He, yeah, no, yeah, he no, attacked. he attacked me, and I parried. Bye, 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 bye. Yeah. All right. So well, he you guys can dodge attack then. each other, and they dodged or parried. Yeah, Karnoth attacked him. I parried his attack. Right. The Space Marine can dodge out of this, then. You should be able to dodge next time you attack him, though. Right. He, he, if yeah. he takes his reaction now to dodge, then he can't parry your blow coming in. Correct. Unless so he has a second uh, like a parry-specific talent, okay. which is called Wall of Steel. So he succeeded oh. at dodging out of the way. 
And he'll have to so, physically move like one meter out of the way. What was the radius again? And like, what is it? Like five, ten? It was a six meter radius. All right. And it was like exactly at the edge of my uh, distance that I could do. All right. So he, he doesn't have to move that far, like out of the way. He does have to dodge more into our visual range, though. Yeah. Yep. That, that's true. <clears throat> Am I sounding dark? Can I hear myself? Uh, oh god, what the fuck? Hello. Uh, hey 12 year old, get off, we're playing a game. Oh. <laughs> uh, I'll be back. No, but your turn was next. No! But, uh, Boca, you, uh, What's up? You heard my son uh, Yeah, you heard go that back. Uh, actually, dodge out of the radius, right? Yeah, I did. I did the dodge. Where? You're right, but he's got to now physically move out of the radius. Yeah. And how? Oh. That's how dodge works. Okay, so he has to go this way. Uh, no, no, up to much. his up to his agility modifier in meters. So like uh, 0. 0.5 meters. Okay, so yeah, just behind you then. Sure. Your voice changed and I totally off, by the way. Yeah. It's, it's off. off. But he did move away from uh, our melee buddy, so he should be able to get a free attack on him. Attack of opportunity, baby. That's right. Is that a thing in this? Yes. If you don't take the uh, the step away action to, pro to the disengage action the, the, or whatever it is, you can use a reaction to Swipe. Oh, wow. Nice. <laughs> oh, boy. How did you hit that? With uh, great skill. <laughs> I'll say that much. Hey, no, that's too bad. No. <laughs> Sorry, I can't oh, hear no. the answer speaking. No, please. Oh, my apologies. I'm trying to get a space voice. Give me a second. Get more echoey. <laughs> What's his uh, armor? Oh, hold on. 100. So that's going to be his torso, right? No, that's going to be his body. Oh, wait, no, that's going to be his left leg. Sorry. What's the armor on his left leg? 24, Boca? I believe. 24, all right. He gets 25, 28 damage to his leg. Ah. Uh. Well, not entirely 28. Righteous Fury. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> and another one. I chopped both, both of, his, of his legs off. Yep. Oh, he's dead? Well, I not think... entirely. Oh, Keep not mind, entirely. He does have 24 armor, so... That, armor that is... 5 is 19. No, He's no, no, dead. no, no. So that, that is considering that he is taking. Yeah, it's it's all calculated. Oh, yeah, he's already calculated in. Okay. He's all dead. Yeah. If it's over nine points of damage, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you could just not. This is the uh, reverb. You're Asgard gray aliens right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. No. I'll stay clean until I can get get. All right. Uh, there's no one else from what I can see. Oh, this one was this one. Oh, wait. Not good. No. No. That one's entirely un unintelligible. It's okay, Boko. You don't have to. What the that was fuck? just that was just Windows sound effects. Just piano music. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
No, no, you sound like one of those people from CNN that's just voice changed and their face blotted out. <laughs> you just can't see who they are, but you can tell who they are. <laughs> oh Wait, my god. How about, how about this one, Frank? That's the exact same. Oh. It's, not, it's not exactly the same. Slightly. Right, it had some pencil sound effects in the background. Okay. Actually, I think I might have been doing more damage than I should have. Let me change that. I like this one. It's not a little better. It's not good. Not. I'm, I'm no, sorry, Boko. You, you do I can't sound, do that. You do sound slightly more Space Marine-ish with that one, but it's too harsh. It, I, that sounds like what I think. Tesseract's character sounds like. <laughs> Is this better? That's I mean, good. It's slightly better, but it's still slightly. Not great. Yeah. It's hard to understand what you're saying. Especially when you cut out so much. <laughs> it's yeah. alright. It's alright. It's like... uh, maybe better? What's your mark? I don't know. I'm pretty sure he just hissed at us, though. Yeah. It hissed at you guys? That's what it sounded like you did. Interesting. There, go a little higher. Is that is the pitch better? Uh, I'm trying. Is he a 12 year old Space Marine? No. Oh, <laughs> this one. It needs to be deeper. Sorry, Poco, you don't need to do the thing. You can just cut it all off. Damn you. It's, it's my duty to hurl insults at you guys. That okay, that's a better. Good. That's a good that's one. That's not bad, but it needs some more fine-tuning. If you can lower the pitch by, like, two... Your mother was a hamster and your father smelt of elderberries. <laughs> I fart in your general direction. What was that? This it's hard to tell you're cutting out pretty good again. Yeah, it's because I'm messing with it, so I guess it's doing stuff. All right, cool. I can switch between the two quickly. All right. Oh, yeah. uh, yep, 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 yep. Funny keybinds. I should be able to. Do. All right. Uh, you guys defeated the Space Marines. Um, you see a very closed door. Am I clean? I'm on clean. Yeah, you're clean. You're clean. Yeah, closed door. Okay. I make sure the northern rooms are clear.
believe there are crews aboard the vessel. What? That's what you hear. Through the door. Yeah, we so, didn't understand what you just said. Exactly. Good. <laughs> Turn around, Dan. Uh, oh, we're looking up. Yep. Mm. So we heard that from up this door. Is that correct? Is there a door there? I can't tell. I don't, I don't think, think there's there supposed to be a door. Up there. I like think it. there's a door right here. I just oh, can't turn the my character anymore for whatever reason. This is a uh, most, I think. All I see is a line of black LOS yeah, blocking same. nonsense. I don't even see the wall. All right. Uh, actually, oh, hey. looks like I see a peak hole here. Ah, <laughs> uh, here's the, the door. Is is the maybe uh, is the possibility should still up? Oh, yes, it is. All it's right. Now I would like to try and uh, open the door <laughs> with my brute strength. And I take aim. What's the what? role modifier for the opening the door with just my hands, Boko? It's gonna be a minus eighty. All right. Oh come on! Oh. <laughs> Actually, are you within the possibility shield? He is. So Here, here's happened? the thing. Oh man, you. You can't, unless you roll a zero, which is impossible on a D100. Oh, man. Yeah. Because you rolled a five. Yeah. But Wait, hold on. So it was minus 80 at the... So it was minus 80. Oh, so that's oh, an nice. additional minus 10, so uh, you can't. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Cannot, Damn. Yep. I, I basically like like try and do that, but I don't succeed. Uh, so yeah. See you. I, you, hear, you hear a lot of a lot of clanking, a lot of rusty noises. This door is designed to stop it. It's like the last vessel you guys invaded. I'm going to look for a button on the wall that will open it. Don't forget to include your plus ten on that observation so, check. So yeah, do an observation check. All right. I see nothing. <laughs> oh no no! Use your character sees a button. Oh, there's a button right there. Push it. Oh. Yes, I push the button. Nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I found a button. Why isn't it doing anything? Anyone want to roll intelligence check on this? Plus, plus 40? Me? Just anyone else besides your character. Oh, okay. Intelligence plus 40? Yeah. yeah. So your character is looking around, sees this is a very old and very unpowered vessel. It is a Space Hulk. <laughs> Everyone else, around. yep, you also know it's the same thing. And Neil Tyson, you can do it too. Want me to do an intelligence check? All right. Yeah, yeah. Just to think about it for a second. All right. Hmm. <laughs> you realize, I'm very huh? smart. <laughs> you realize? Wait a minute. This is an unpowered space. There is no power on this vessel. It's the reactor's long been, ex been extinguished. Wait a minute. There's no power on this vessel. No wonder the do door won't any, open. Do we have any explosive charges with us? Nope. Great. So you examine the door, though. Anyone examining the door? I examine the door. Sure, why not? I'll examine the door. What do I roll? Uh, observation check. Or awareness check plus twenty. Oh right, my god! Okay. I just found something amazing. What is it? What? You can rotate your character token by pressing by holding E and then rotating your mouse wheel. That's amazing. Oh, that's cool. Hey. Oh god, that little ball thing is annoying. Yeah. Thank you. 
Um, so character, uh, as he's looking around, see that the uh, the heretics have <laughs> have have braced and sealed this door on the other side. You can see, obviously, like weld shuts down the center of this door. So it's weld shut. All right. Uh, right. Brisora, what's your mind? All righty. I'll start popping holes in the door like last time. Uh, have we checked? Have we checked the immediate area for any other entrances or exits? No. Yeah, Maybe we should do it. that. But we could just open it though. What if it goes to a derelict section that's exposed to the void? Yeah, what if this one goes to a derelict section that's exposed to the void? That's what I just said. <laughs> are, there, are there other areas on this ship, like this little hallway that goes up here? I'm sure and, we got apparently this, blocks line of sight to literally everything else. Cool, I love this line of sight blocker. Say hey. again? Did I just, Where? Yeah, I, I had gone up no. here, and I, the the wall blocker blocks all vision of all walls. Yeah, so I can't tell if there's a door anywhere or if uh, that's all walls. That's it's all walls. Wall. Yeah, so everything up over is here. Wall. Right. Uh, right. Uh, hold up. Uh, so Brasora, go ahead. Yeah, go back in that room. All right, about here. Yeah, do an observation check. All right. Yeah. You mean the grate that's uh, down there where someone can crawl through it? Yeah. I was going to give him, uh, you know, plus 20 on it and then thanks. Well, plus 20, you say? So, <clears throat> you know, it's an old ventilation shaft. Uh, Is it Space Marine sized? It's fairly large. Probably crawl through it. Is it one of those shitty ones that we have to ditch our weapons in order to get through it? <laughs> like like that one ship we were on? Well, you didn't have to ditch your weapon. You just had to not have it out in front of you. Yeah, right, we had to path. ditch him. No, you can holster a weapon. Yeah, but we had to ditch him and bring him in via his string. Yeah, but basically, we're not unarmed. Basically, yeah, we're not armed. I'm doing so. Right. It was just enough space for you. Anyways, uh, this does not look like space. What? Yeah. Looks big enough for a human. You cut out. Oh, it looks big enough for you to go through. Ah. Not not really space marine size, but a regular person. All right. I guess I'll peek my head and see what I see. I am here with the possibility shield while you're there, so. Okay, on the other side. Are you going to be stealthing the whole way, Moth? Hmm. No, he's just going to reveal himself to the enemy the moment he I, gets yeah. the opportunity. I'm, I, I, don't, I don't know what I, he's going to be doing. I was just peeking my head through to see if I saw anything on the other side, and if I didn't, then I'd pop back the over. Yeah, move the character. Gonna pop back over? Yeah. Well, that shaft leads to a giant open room, but I don't see any way to get the door open from over there. At least not immediately. Right. You can explore any further in that room? You're gonna just uh, move on somewhere else. Hmm. The others can try and find a thing, but I feel this is probably the best method forward. Try searching near the door if you can find a release lever or something on the other side. But of course, I if you am, encounter danger, get back immediately. I am not a stealthy individual in any way, shape, or form. Just keep your head on a swivel. The moment you see anything, book it back here. Alright. Carnops looks over and gives you a thumbs up. You got this. You got this. Don't die. 
Okay, now that she's dead. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I uh, presume you're going to be taking command. So are you exploring elsewhere, uh, Yomug? Any other ways around that door? Uh, I'm just going to suggest to the group, I mean, try and open some panels, try and find some kind of release lever mechanism within the wall. See what you can do, Tech Marine. Everyone else, look for other panels in the walls that might lead to uh, access ways or such. I start ripping out panels, every panel I see. As a, you guys have uh, lower uh, um, Stardis, right? Or Stardis? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Adaptus yeah. of Stardis. Okay. So one of you guys can run that for that operation, that door if you want. See. I'm going to do that. Modifier? Plus 20. <laughs> so, so Domangus hey, I and, succeeded. and Domangus succeeded, succeeded too. Domangus and shit, the I rolled too. Right. You know that would be a death sentence going through that that door, that breach. Because as an Astartes, they'd be setting up a trap for any invaders. There's going to be a at least a tactical squad on the other side. I relay that information to everybody. We do not it's what you, go through it, that door. It, it's what you guys would do. If fending off borders. I mean, yeah. Right. So I'd be. Yeah. No boy, no. Okay. Moth. See dark hallways. See. And you hear. I appear to be going the wrong direction, so I think I'm just going to go back. Hold up. And then you hear the space talk. Okay. Indistinguishable noises. Well, I'm definitely I, going back. I uh, heard a hiss. They must be huffing on that copium. <laughs> on those yep. warp fumes, yeah. Still in that vapor. So this uh, tunnel is very clearly not large enough for anyone else. Just, just Restore is large and are small enough to fit in it, right? That's correct. Okay. She's crawling through it too, and she's very dirty going through it. That's quite. It's a lot of dust has collected for the ages. Collected all of it. So founded what sounded like at least one Chaos Marine, but it appeared to be going the entirely wrong direction, the pathway. I don't think there's a way to open the door from that side, at the least. Hmm. Hmm. I I start to investigate this pipe right here. Okay, cool. Uh, is that just search, or yeah, modifier? Uh, minus twenty. Um. See that the pipe connecting the wall is fairly large. Uh, you guys could probably crawl through it, and it's broken. But ever so. And whatever contents were in it, it's long since expired. You but at least nice. somewhere. I would hope Neil the sewage is expired. <laughs> Neil Tyson, what is this pipe for? And where do you think you should lead to? Uh, I'm going to roll tech use on the pipe to see what it is. Or would that be a different roll, Boko? Tech use be general technology. Alright. I uh, succeeded. Yeah, so it's a fuel line. So this it's is a fuel, a line, fuel that, line. Yeah, it would lead into uh, another room kind of describe or leading to like a storage facility room where all the fuel would be pulled up and allocated to old vessels but this is an older pattern design like you have not seen before. so i'm going to check for condensation on the pipes or any sort of indication that there's no, it's, fuel running no the mangus tells you it's cracked open but over ever so slightly and there's there's nothing in it you must have ah part. okay 
Or at least, dude, you related that information, I imagine? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Brother so Domenego, this is a fuel line. It's lain unused for some time. However, it may lead to a room with stuff in it. Uh, it's, uh, so be a kind of a fuel depot for... A fuel depot. Right, so it would lead somewhere. It's going to lead to a main tank and some other tanks along the way. That's possibly a way in. If it's, but if there should be no fuel in this vessel. It's a very old vessel. The now, real, just remember, the real fuel is the tanks we made along the way. True. Right. But that crack is ever so, ever so slight. You peer into it. You'd have to break it open. Or open it. Realize it. But it is fairly large. You guys I, grab, I grab onto it with my big space marine hands and uh, try to bend the pipe open. Would you have a servo arm for this kind of thing? Oh, yeah. I use my servo arm. <laughs> okay. So it pops, pops open. All these. Right. It, crumbles, it crumbles as you're manipulating it. Just are you telling the other, other Marines? That. Are you telling the other Marines about this pipe? Yeah. Yeah. I come over and I guess I would like to assist. Alright, I guess we should head over then too. Excellent. Is it, is it just a damage roll? Is it a strength roll? How, how do we. Already open. Oh. Okay. So who's going to go through first? And are you going to send the whole team? Or are you going to send one Z2? Well, this is our only path forward, so I recommend it all. Oh, my, my vision seems to have temporarily left me. One moment. Who's going to go first, Tyson? Who turn uh, off I the think, lights? I think I would, I, would, I would like to go first. Or not? Yeah. I'll follow up. All right. Next. I guess I can go next. All right, as you guys... Stay in this. If I can stay in the center, I can give everyone around me the possibility shield instead of just being Ooh. in the back. The walls don't exist down here. Oh my god! I can see into adjacent corridors and rooms. This is yeah. what warp does to you, yeah? No, as you as you enter, uh, it's open to the back base this area. Very ruined, very destructed. Uh, what did you say? Very ruinous area, like. The old, like an old oh, battle. I thought room. you said open to the vacuum of space. Yes, you guys are fine. Wait, you did say that then. Yes, you did. It's all right. Or you're not fine, right? Um, we all got sealed spacesuits. Okay, then you're fine. I'm slowly going forwards. Shin raised. So good thing I have the mag boots. Click on, click clunk. Yep. Well, you guys... boots. I do not have mag boots, but I have a jetpack. I have mag boots. <laughs> yeah, as you guys are going through, you guys see various old ancient fuel fuel cans, fuel accessories, cargo. Oh, this goes into the void, guys. Yep. See just the just the, the whole corridor that was there is no longer there. So see so down the ship. Ooh. I found the void. The void. <laughs> Do not look at the void. Who turned the lights on in the void? <laughs> <laughs> Turn your gaze away. No. <laughs> Lest it stare back at you. Oh, I probably should make that black. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's usually black with white spots, not white with black spots. <laughs> but this is like warp tainted, so who knows? <laughs> yeah. There. How about now? A little better? A little better for you? be a black background now. Yeah. Yeah. This anyway. area seems clear. There's no one present. All right. Search are for you able more. to see like this area? Are you able to move this area? Yeah. No, I don't think we can. Can we? No. Yep. It, yeah. It's... See it. You can go do it. Holes. Giant gaping holes. It's just like we're going to have to go through. Okay. Fine. Hole. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. They go through. Go through base. 
All right. We have two uh, contacts right here. Now yep. that one be walls. I don't know why it's not doing. <laughs> we don't yeah, have any holes. We can see them. <laughs> we can just do it. Yeah, we can just shoot them from here. There's no holes. What are you talking about? I gotta go through this corridor slowly. But yeah, I guess you would have saw them as you guys were jumping over the area here. No. Oh, I see no, no, no. I don't think we would have. Be careful. Oh, this may be an ambush walls, point. More, more guys right here. This could be an ambush point. Alright, where do we go? Do we go up or down? Well, this is an ambush point. I'm not sure. Either way, the others will flank us. Unless we plant a mine right here, then then they're going to have a less of a fun time. Do we there have a is. mine? We have grenades. Very well. Then, uh, Karnoth, if you don't mind, go ahead and plant your, a melter grenade right here. Actually, hold on. Let me oh. check. Did I? You just see no, that. I did not door. take the militians. So you're, you're see, that, right. see, that, see that door collapse? Oh. oh, well, I guess we no longer have to worry about this oh. door. Oh, or that door. Right. Or, or that, that door. Entire side. <laughs> I would like to punch the door. <laughs> it's okay. I think we can just go this way. You I hear, still punch the door. <laughs> you, hear more ch you hear more chattering. All right. Whatever. I, I don't. I, I no longer punch the door. Oh, we can still go through this hallway. I yeah, we can go through to... walls. By the no, way, I mean, base is cut off. We can still move up this way. Yeah, right. Volko, we're supposed to go here. And... Oh, right. No, is I this... guess we can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You what? can go through. Okay. That's all destroyed. All that stuff was destroyed. Oh, so this is like destroyed, basically. Right, and those doors are open, but that fucking wall there. Careful, they're right there. In fact, I'll draw what's... They're right there. Who? <laughs> I'm going to go outside the lines. I'm going to be like, right here in the wall. You can't stop me. I'm in the wall. I'm living in your walls. So anything that's red? Droid? Okay. Oh, okay. So red we can move through? That's correct. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we can. Uh, they're right there. <laughs> they they don't see you, but they they you hear them chattering that they're just talking about uh, imperial scum. Get ready. Then I would like to charge in. <sighs> Hup! Okay. And I would like do your to action? do a hit. Yep. I'm guessing we have a surprise round. Yeah, oh yeah. Um, Would he be aware enough to deflect or to parry? They knew you guys were somewhere over there. Didn't know where you guys are from. Be a ah shit. No one cover that angle. So go ahead. Do your damage. I'm gonna do. Yeah. So my oh sorry, that's not that's not correct. That's not correct. Uh, my damage is still busted, so we're just going to take away 1d10 from it. I'm still trying to fix it, but it's going to be fixed soon. All right. Uh, Where so does that hit? 50. Uh, that's going to be head. Uh, he's super dead if you only lost 10. No, no, no. That, that's not the damage I'm doing. I'm doing another damage roll. Uh, what's the AC, uh, the armor on 24. the head? 24. 20, 24 head and length. And that's going to be 10 penetration. So that's going to be minus 8 from that. So that's going to be uh, 23. 23 damage with 10 pen. You decapitate him. Dead. Damn. And then I take a shot at the next uh, Murray, Chaos Murray. Okay. Do your thing. I did plus 60 since it's space 40, then chaos, then uh, then close range. So that's 7.1. Dolby 7.1 surround sound? <laughs> that would be 8 hits, correct? 
That would be a hit, correct. Oh, uh, whether you mean like it's going to multiple or not, I don't know, actually. Uh, it says that it's just an attack. It doesn't say one hit. So... so you're firing to... a full auto, right? Yeah. Well, it would be seven, seven damage. Seven, eight, eight hits. It's eight hits, hit. okay. Sorry, great. Do your damage. And where does it all land? Uh, 46 if he's not calling his Oh, no. I think I did this wrong. Oh, uh, I get it now. I'm, I'm messing around with that new... Uh, yes, so AP thing, is so. the AP they have, and then AP penetration is the one you have. Yeah, I definitely typed in wrong. So which thing... So I did a, got a 64. Where do I hit him? Uh, uh, yes, right. Yeah, so that's 44. Are you doing a cold 40. shot, or are you just doing just normal damage? Normal damage. Okay, then yeah. Uh, 64 is... Torso. No, that's 46. That, yeah, that's also torso, yep. Good so dude, what is it, 46, 40? I'm hearing a bunch of numbers. So, Sorry, you, you rolled a 64, so determining location, you reverse the numbers, so it would be 46, 46 is torso. So the armor, uh, armor's 40, 46. Uh, the armor know. would be 44. 44. These guys are not, yeah. pretty big. Yeah, none of those hit, basically. Yeah. You just see it bounce off his armor. Ping, 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 ping. Okay. Who else has a surprise action? I guess I'll go next. Um, I'm going to throw a crack grenade at this, uh, dingus head over here. Alright. Alright, let's see. Crack grenade to hit. Alright. And let's roll damage. Oh, man. It, that was he crazy. laughs at it. Back. <laughs> he has to say something to that. Damn. That's my I'm turn, Don. Move up. Boom. Okay. Do we all roll for initiative then? Yeah. Uh, I think I still got something, right? Oh, yeah. Question is, can we move in a surprise round? I think so. Yes. All right, then. Basically, imagine that if you have like just a regular round, but they can't attack. Or, or do anything yet. Ha! Tech trinkets and toys. Your people relics of the gun are outdated. Your understanding of the power. That crack grenade, a mere tickle in the presence of the dark gods might. Keep tinkering in your workshop, chanting to your false idols. Maybe one day they'll understand what it means to be truly alive. But I doubt it, servo slave. Damn, Damn where was your uh where was your voice changer for that? You hyped As it you wanna, that? Did you want a voice changer for it? I, I don't know. I mean, I think it's ooh, funny. Seventy-one straight to a leg. Because he went through a whole bunch of uh, voice changer stuff, and now you're not even doing it. Oh man, that's oh, got a sting. Ah. Ah. A tech race breaking in toys. Your feeble rules are outdated. Will be easier on the same power. That crack grenade. A rear tickle press the dark gods might. By the way, eat, as eat. he says that, he takes, uh, what is that, 30, uh, 35 damage to a leg? Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna say this, and then he's gonna die. A mere tickle to press the dark gods might. Keep team your workshop, changing your false idols, and one day you'll understand what it means to be really alive. Right down it, servo slay. Alright, now, and Boko, then, uh, give us your best death throws you possibly can with the voice filter on. Here. What? 
I'm just curious as to how we're hearing him say this in the vacuum of his face. <laughs> Radio. All right, Poco, give us give us like your best fucking death throws that you can possibly do. Yeah. I need to hear this right. shit. Did you not get it? Well, let me let me check my sensitivity. Oh, my sensitivity. Oh. All right. Do it, do it, do it, do mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Piggy, why is not Piggy in the voice? Oh, he doesn't want to pick up that. He doesn't want to pick up the voice. Interesting. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, maybe we try again. Oh, uh -oh. It is. I heard a vague. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's like the AI picks up on when I'm making random noise like that. Oh, my it leg. <laughs> Did you turn off your uh, noise cancellation in Discord? It's not it. There's AI. I hate the voice mod. And I think canceling out noises that are not supposed uh, to be transmitted. So it is two layers of noise cancellation. Damn. I love how I'm this as a space for you. Anyways. They're over there. And as the second uh, space marine dies, I hear her spawn. Just tell him famous last words. <laughs> oh, wait, I didn't do my initiative. Whoops. Yeah. There you go. Guys, got guys, got here. All right, you can turn the filter off now. Oh, they're they trash on Not bad. That's going to be negative 10 for Ghost Rider. Okay, uh, Rosora, what, what is yours? 18? Why is it not updating? I didn't have my token selected. Oh, okay. So I'll just, I'll just, make, I'll just do it on this end. Six. Nine, oh, we're on. doing initiative now? Yeah. Yes. So, B. Persora, uh, Eric Clades, what'd you get? I'm on there. It's a 10. Okay, cool. I was making sure. I didn't see it change, so I was double checking. So, Persora, go. Yeah, did they roll for? They did. Yeah, they oh. got the same. They got the same as last time. Okay. They got. I forgot to get a. Plus, I forgot to add the plus three, but they rolled a nine, so that'd be twelve. They would have to. So roll are again. these uh, tank things in the middle intact or in pieces or? They're in pieces. You can All use right, them so as cover. Through. You can. Yeah, you can, there's not much metal there, but you can kind of use it as a uh, concealment if you want to hide behind them. I was trying to make sure I didn't have to, you know, move all the way up, say, here to be able to shoot them. No, <laughs> this room's completely destroyed and derelict like the others. I like the other. Just remember, everyone currently is in my possibility shield. Yep. Oh, I saw him token. I don't know, Boko, if there's a way to uh, show everyone else my aura. I can see your aura. Can they not yeah, see but, it? Yeah, but can they see it? Uh, I don't think You need to enable it. It needs to be like when you click your token. It's, I think it's only, only VDM can do that to make it like public. Visible to everybody. Yeah. yeah it is. I, can't, I'm like... I can't make it visible to everyone else, but I can just edit it. But if they could see it, then they'd know where my circle is. How about now? See it now? Yep. Yep. Sweet. So as long as you're in that circle, you've got the possibility shield. All right, I'm going to shoot this guy over here. Full auto, let's go.
I think next time we're going to have to bring special ammo for these guys. I actually have that special ammo. I just haven't used it yet. Any, any of them get through? Uh, let's see. And where were we hitting? What would a he that was 60, right? If Yeah, yeah. Okay, so the first... Okay, one's in the body and one's in the leg. So let me do the body first then. Or just ignore it because none of these will do anything for that. Okay. Yeah, body shots you're probably going to do deadly. So just do the leg damage I mean total. All right, leg would be left. So... They have how much armor on the legs again? 24? 24. All right, so anything over 20. So that's uh, one, five. And one celestial, one fury thing, I think. Five damage to the leg. Wait, wait. I can add a D10 to a damage roll, can I? Yeah, go for it. Yeah, but just one of them. Aha! What's another nine damage? You'll be yours. Opening fire. And he's going to be targeting you, Moth. Oh, no. Guy you shot at. And he fucking missed. Of course he did. <laughs> he rolled a 99. So, <laughs> so he was using a heavy bolter. His heavy bolter. Hang on. You just, it, you just that, see a chain re Doesn't that mean it's gun uh, jams? I'm doing something he's, a little bit more. Oh, okay, okay. A bit more than that. So, so you just see him explode. What a big fireball. Fuck? You just see him. <laughs> oh, the man. Emperor protects. Right. And then you see his body kind of just like sucked into like it seemed like a portal or something. The other one is going. I'm going to roll one. May are one d five? They roll the same initiative. Damn. They all, no, mm -hmm. I run them as a I run them as a group. Ah, uh -huh, gotcha. I don't run them in separate. That's gonna be a headache. Uh, one d five. So Moth, you're one. Devangus, you're two. Heracles, you're three. Karnoth, four. Niels Heisen, you're five. So he's going for Heracles. I thought I was three. Or no, Devangus. Sorry, my apologies. Uh -huh. My huh? my brain my brain was looking at you and then I said he's gonna be shooting at you. Oh, okay. okay. I'll attempt to dodge on that. And it's what how many rolls? Seven on that one, right? Yep. Six. I might want to dodge this one. Uh, righteous, yep. righteous Your degree of success in oh, no, the or how many bullets right. you get to dodge? Yeah. They don't have Righteous Fury because they're, they're Chaos Marines. Yeah, I they don't get Righteous Fury. Well, I can't parry them all, can I? You can't parry bullets. You're no, not but a, when you dodge, a your degrees of success is every bullet. Yep. Yeah, so, how mo so what's the modifier for that? Also, you may want to use the plus 10 on this Six. one. And I got one more. Seven. Boko, any uh, modifiers? Minus 20. So it'll be minus 10. Mm -hmm. There really shouldn't be any penalty. It's a regular dodge roll, but all right. It's yeah. a regular dodge roll, yeah. Oh, okay. Then no modifier. But he would still get hit. Yeah, I still get hit. Where? Yep. Yeah, you rolled. Uh, There's no saving that roll. Uh, I think you're uh, going to uh, just 82 do a legs. Let me just do a Righteous Fury. 
He's shooting at your feet, three. making you dance. Minute yeah. Answer. Hey. You mean fate? So yeah, that's fate. Four of those dodged. So the first four one, two, three, four. So all the way past the 29. So you take 30, 29, 24 to the legs. With a pen the of legs. Eight. Pen of eight. Pen of eight. Yep. <laughs> I mean, they, they hit as hard as you guys. They're Space Marines, too. Uh, well, technically, I am standing in front of uh, the Monego. I am in the line of sight, the line of fire. Could I act as cover for the Monego? Trying to think here. You do have a shield. I right. Have a shield up. Uh, I guess you could do a dodge. And if you can get split the bullet count in half between the two of them. Well, if he can exceed what he rolled on that attack, he could block all the all the incoming rounds. As degrees of success. Can I dodge to get into the line of fire? That's what I'm saying. Okay. If you can, if you can match his degrees of success, you you can dodge, you can absorb all the hits. So every degree oh, success you, you can block maybe a bullet. I can you block get, a bullet. <laughs> you're like, no! Ping, so you Ping. block the 30. You block the 30. I so blocked the 20, 30. Yeah, the 29 and 24 still hit him in the legs. How much damage would, would that How much did it block? How much did you block? He blocks 30. So you are going to take the 8. And before you take that damage card off, you do have the shield, which gives you a 55% chance to just well, not take that's, damage. Well, that's 36 points of damage. Oh, that's true. No, hold on. That's, I think that's an aura I have. Let me see. And I oh. also have an aura around me, a force field around me as well. Oh, okay. So, uh, let's see. But that's only around me, though. That's think that extends past. You're, gonna, you're, still, yeah. you're, gonna hit, you're getting hit by the 30, so you'll have to take that. Uh, let's see. Uh, right, his force field though would let him ignore the thirty. Okay. I think he'd one range to ten. But it's like a roll. He has, he has to roll a fifty-five or under to ignore it. Okay. Just uh, hold on. Let me just roll one d two hundred. Do that. Up, I didn't do this. Uh, yep, I block one additional. I block one additional uh, round. But that's okay, only, so that's the only, that's the thing I can only do once per combat encounter, basically. So you're taking the thirty and the twenty-nine. Yep. Okay. 29 just deflects to the side like ricochets. You got to resolve the... Well, it doesn't ricochet. You're, you're, you're absorbing those hits for him. I, I absorbed the 30, but the one that I activated my deflective field. Okay. Uh, and so that deflects. It doesn't absorb, so it's like kind of ricochets to like to the side. Basically. Okay, cool. So, Domingus, you're only taking 24 with a pin of 8. To the leg. Yeah, in total. Yep. Oh, not in total. Uh, so, pen of eight, so whatever your armor is on your legs, uh, you're going to negate eight of that, and then 24 minus whatever armor you have left. What's your leg armor? 20. Okay, minus so eight. 12, so you take 12 damage. Yep. Mm -hmm. Ouch. <laughs> I, yeah, better yeah, than better than rest. better than taking the entire thing. I yeah, that was dead. a full auto shot. <laughs> you gotta thank uh, Karnoff there. He saved your bacon. And that's what you've been doing to our enemies. <laughs> Ouch! I think I got I got to taste my own medicine. <laughs> yeah, you did. Okay. Guess what? It's your turn. You could you could do it right back to him now. See, here's a problem. I want to switch to vengeance rounds. Vengeance, which rounds. means I need to reload. Does your heavy bolter have a fire selector on it? No. Aw. Are you sure? Yeah. Aw, oh, you mm. need to get that upgrade. Okay. Yeah, you definitely need to get that upgrade. It doesn't have... It's, fi it's a full, full automatic only. Okay. Because so the regular reload. bolters... Because the regular bolters I know for attack marines come with a uh, ammo selector. I mean, you have wait, hold on, hold rounds. wait, wait. I think I misunderstood something. There's a difference between ammo selector and a fire selector. Fire, yes. fire selector does both. 
it mm -hmm. allows you to select your rate of fire and what ammo you want. What? That's it's it's a single item that does both things. It's okay. confusing and it's weird. Also, you have uh, on your regular ammo, you have a thing where if an enemy has more than 10 uh, armor points, then you get a plus 4 to penetration. So you would have 11 penetration instead of 7 on your, on your gun. That's like a thing your gun has after being upgraded. Say that again. So if a target has more than 10 armor points, uh, you can uh, use your uh, your ammo has a sp uh, special uh, property that it increases its penetration by four if it hits an armor target. Oh! So instead of doing seven penetration per shot, you would be doing uh, eleven penetration per shot. That's oh, what uh, the, the thing is in your uh, macro for. So you have like normal uh, penetration. Yeah. Yeah, an armor target penetration. So the the pen will become eleven if the armor is greater than ten. Gotcha. Yep. Are you gonna fire back at this butthole? Yeah. Cause he hits you and he almost kills you too. Yeah, so <clears throat> how far is he? Uh dang. That's a little bit more than half range. Barely. <laughs> He's almost at it. Just do the plus 20. It's not quite in half range. It's slightly the outside. So, plus 20, that would be plus 60. Then it's going to be chaos, so plus 70, right? If and you then... want, you can also make a cold shot to aim at his head, for example, which is slightly uh, less armored than his body, for example. If that's yeah, I want to aim at his head. So, is that like... What's the, Minus uh, 20. Minus 20, this will yeah, so, 50 in total. Yep, go for it. Nice. So, fire. Six shots. AP, what's there? Our 24. Armor is 24. And AP oh. is armored, oh. right? He just, yep. He's, he's just going to eat shit. Yep. <laughs> I think I like those odds. <laughs> What's the damage total? Do you have 10 of 11? 110. So 13, he absorbed 13, so he's taking 5. This, this, this so the damage that you already. see is the actual ca calculated damage after everything is calculated. So armor. Oh, so then he's, through armor. he's dead. Yeah. All right, that's over. That's neutralized. Okay, I'm going to switch right. to Avengers Rails because clearly the regular bullets won't do. <laughs> so do we uh, do we want to continue? Yes. I'm going to stay here. Yep, I'm going to like stand watch here. All right. I'm a reload. So here, this is the visions rounds. It's supposed to be against uh, space, uh, chaos space marines. Weapon gains the failing one quality, and its penetration increases to nine. Finish rounds detonate prematurely on attack roll of ninety-one through one hundred. When this happens, the fire suffers explosive damage equal to weapons damage with a pen of five on an armor location. Okay. This automatically causes the weapon to jam and happens to quickly to avoid the damage by dropping the weapon. Okay, so filling... Uh, is it, if it hits, it ignores a number of... Uh, it ignores a natural toughness, basically. So filling one, it, it drops down there. If they have like a natural toughness of three, it will drop drop it down to a natural toughness too, for the purpose of calculating damage. So basically, they will have way less armor. Right. When it says 
penetration increases to nine, I get nine additional uh, penetration. It, uh, no, no, no. It, 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 it's set to nine. Uh, uh, so that's me, not going to be helpful. Add... Well, that's going to be slightly helpful. If it says increases to nine, shouldn't it be nine or your higher penetration on your weapon if it's higher? I think it it means like because like normal weapons have like a pen of five. Normal bolters has a pen of five. Yeah, it would increase it to nine. But if you already yeah, have higher, nine. then it wouldn't do anything penetration wise. Yeah, yeah, so it's it's set to nine. Yeah. Well, I feel like I got the short end of well, the stick on vengeance wet rounds. Then vengeance rounds are great against basically chaos entities because even though technically you deal to more penetration. Uh, you ignore one of their unnatural toughnesses, which brings down their overall armor way like drastically down. So, in overall, it's a net positive. Gotcha. That's a hell of a shot. Hey, Boko. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Oh. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, Karnath, you're hearing this behind you. One second. You're hearing that right behind you, Karnoth. Coming from. Oh, I'm, re I'm reading. You're hearing it. I, I relay that to my team that they have a dreadnought prepared for us. Be, yeah. be vigilant. Yep. Hear it. Obvious radio chatter coming from that dead body. Oh, from the dead body. Oh, okay. I, I got it. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Does anyone have any armor piercing? <laughs> uh, armor oh, piercing. he's... He's super dead. The guy's obviously dead. No, I'm asking my team. No, uh, I've, like we're... I've got my Melsa pistols. It's twenty pen. Ooh. It is rounds, oh. and I have vision rounds for my. Uh, I was about to say Gatling gun. That's not a heavy bolter. Might as well be a Gatling gun. And I have Hellfire uh, rounds. Vengeance rounds don't really work on uh, vehicles because they don't have toughness. They just have like. Uh, Basically, they have sheet metal, which is not. It's still a higher difference. penetration value than default rounds. Yeah. So it's still no, better to use, but. No, for for Domenango, if uh, the target is armored, regardless of whether it's a machine or not, he gets a his penetration set to eleven. Otherwise, it's like seven. So, overall, for machines, for like uh, walkers, using normal ammo would be more beneficial to him. But for everything else, uh, it will be beneficial to use Vengeance Rounds. Gotcha. All right. Well, before the walls closed in, I saw a group of Marines this way. Uh, here, hey, Boko, is this a wall that's solid? One. Right over here. The red ping. Yeah. Solid wall? Yeah. All right, you might want to make it solid because I can see the guy behind the wall over there. No, uh, there's... I was making sure you can see the wall. There's the things there. Boop. See? I'll make it a little bit bigger. But yes, you can see him because you can see him. But can I hit him? <laughs> uh... It's like around three corners, maybe like the narrowest field of vision. There's gonna be a tight shot, yeah. Yeah. If you can see him, you can shoot him. And Boko already said you can see him. Yep. So I'm gonna shoot him. Yeah, he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
All right, left was a 21. Where'd you hit him? All right, hold up. A 21 and 50. Five. A 50. So what is that? 21 is uh, left arm, and 50 is torso. Okay. So, so. torso is probably not going to be able to do anything. Yeah, I can't pen 50. I can't pen 40 armor. So the torso one does nothing. My table is wasted. I'll go for arm now. So they, what, they got 24 armor on the arms? Yeah. Ten damage so 10 total. damage made it through, yep. You keep posting that. Yep. I'm uh, posting different ones. Oh. These are different ones. It's not the same one. How much, how much damage do you total? 10 to his arm. I would, arm. I would voice these, but I don't want to kill my voice. Right. Oh. Brother Karnak, something is amiss. The first horror squad has not reported in. They were stationed near the initial breach point of the Death Watch. This cannot be overlooked. The silence of our brethren may signal a stealth advance by the Death Watch. They might have already engaged our forces. Should we investigate or keep fortifying our position? Continue with the defense of our field depot. I'll inform Lord Galleon and request a scouting team to check on the first horror squad. But from now on, we must go radio silent. The Death Watch may be monitoring our communications. Uh -oh. Understood, Brother Karnak. I'll prepare for Dreadnought and remain silent until further notice. May the Dark Gods guide us. The battle is far from over, and we must be cunning and ruthless as our foes. Silence your vox and await my signal. The eyes of chaos are upon us. So, the reason why... They, oh, so they had previous uh, conversation. Uh, yes. Pretty much it said the Death Watch team was detected at the Ancient Field Depot, which we were just at. Yep. And they're saying that it's a vital, uh, vital, vital choke point. point. Yep. They have guys stationed there. They even sealed it off, if you remember. Yeah. So, yeah, they have guys there. Yep. And as I said, there's like a squad up here. And you just, yeah, you, you, uh, and this is first horror squad, so you obviously killed first horror squad here. You entered through a breach. And then uh any more damage moth from you? Uh nope, that was everything plus righteous fury, so Okay. Uh anyone else gonna do damage to this guy? I think I'm the only one who had a shot. Yeah, I can't see anything. Yeah, I cannot see anything. I'm just standing here in front of you guys. Okay. I don't think I'm in an initiative since I'm kind of away from the battle. Just no, so, uh, Rosario, you just see that Space Marine kind of back off after getting shot like he did, holding his arm. I wounded one, but he ran. The coward. Noted. Enemy contact up there, by the way, in case anybody wants to know. Will we advance or will we hold our position? Advance, brothers. We need to wipe out all the scourge from this dreadnought. Whole thing. Tom, my ears. What are you doing way over there? You just scouting ahead? Yeah. Contacts to the left. Are you going to engage that Dominguez? Are you going to run? They're oh, looking I'm just right at run you. Back. Yeah, because they're looking right at you. Multiple contacts to the left. Hold yeah. here and let's regroup until we engage. Before we engage. Oh, should I see other business? Yeah. yeah they, just, they just ran past 
they saw Dominagus and they heard gunfire from there, so they are approaching gunfire. <clears throat> So you guys going to engage, or are you guys going to run? I think we should fall back and pull them into the choke point if we can. Agreed. Pulling back. We'll pull back, and then we'll use a squad ability, strong point. Hell yeah. Oh my god, we're actually doing something? We're actually using them? <laughs> yeah, I just gotta find it in the rule book. What is this rule book you're speaking of? I will put myself the on codex. the codex. Astartes. I see, brother. Of course, brother. I will put myself on Overwatch if anything goes in my line of sight. I will shoot at them. I'm pretty that sure we've enemy. all played XCOM at least once. Yeah. Yes. I'm just saying we could do Overwatch in this. Overwatch yeah. is a an ability we can have. Indeed. We can have. Wait, we have Overwatch. We have Overwatch. We could shoot anything in our line of sight after a turn of use. Oh. Well, that would be nice to know. So, we can use Dig In, which doubles any armor we gain from cover, but we haven't used cover ever in this game so far. Okay, excuse me, I am the walking cover. <laughs> I'd very much like cover from a wall. Uh, we can use Go to Ground, which is just, uh, as a reaction, everybody goes to ground. Just so you know, uh, Mov, I have 39 uh, armor, like, just base without my shield up. Like, God without damn. blocking with my shield. So, if that was going to be doubled, you're not going to take any damage whatsoever if you're behind me. So. That's nice. Duly noted, because I have 16 armor and 21 health. There and you found the torso. dreadnought. What the? What? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, sweet. Yeah, so, yeah, we're definitely using strong point. We want to I, pull the should I, I should probably retreat to you. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that'd be a smart idea. Yeah, that'd be smart. <laughs> because I was watching our flanks, and I think I found our flank. So the Dreadnought's coming in through this way, you say? Uh, I saw it in the hallway. I don't know if he's going to... I don't know which direction he's going to take. Uh, well, there were, like, three guys over here, a two guys over here, and another two guys over here. Um, I think I saw another couple guys up here. Yes, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, and then apparently Dreadnought's from over here. So if we can draw them into this choke, like right where we are, that would be uh, nice. We can use strong point. We can do strong point to extreme benefit. Uh, basically, what it does is I don't move, and everyone within my uh, our aura range, although it's bigger, whoop, because. Uh, I forgot how to do the range for aura. On, you you uh, can set a second aura. I, I I know. I'm saying I forgot the range of our squad aura. Uh, I think it's like fellowship bonus plus something something. Uh, uh, it's going to be in cohesion. Oh, well, that's how that works. I am going to switch to Psy Cannon Bolts. I think I still have a few left. All right. Anyone can find the support range of uh, the right, squad let me, let abilities. Me uh... Okay, one second. I'm just gonna set up. And hit the bathroom real quick. Uh, 
Uh, this, this, this is a Twitch about a can affect other members, some support range, about a better rank. Okay. Yada yada. Ah, here we go. Uh, what's what's our rank? Four, I think. Four? Okay, so our uh, support range is 60 meters away. Yep. Cool. So I will do another aura of 60 meters. Bam. So as long as we're in this range... We can get the benefit from a uh, strong point. Oh, oh yeah, we don't see that by the way. Oh well, <laughs> someone's gonna, so and someone as in the GM is gonna have to make, make it, it so. Visible. Yeah. But anyway, so the way strong point works is I don't move, and anyone I can see on my turn as a free action, I can just go that guy kill him, and everyone gets a plus twenty to hit that guy. Oh, Jesus, that's a huge area. Yeah. And you may reroll damage against it. And oh, may that's... use the reactions to make a standard attack against it whenever I designate it as a free action. Or as a reaction on, at any point. Oh, damn. However, um, I don't believe I can move whatsoever. Well, you might want to get your character to get in cover, though. Yeah, but I also want to be in a, a spot where I can see people coming through. Yeah, that would mean this is probably best cover for that. Are you guys going to hold, pos hold position as they attack yeah. you guys? or Yeah, basically that's the, the idea. As we set up a, a corridor of fire and uh, we can shoot people. Tech like Marine, can you make a... Is there like a, a path yep. behind us which can like... We should probably like put some mines in there if someone's gonna come behind us. Or, like make a. I don't know explosive that spirit. we have mines. I mean, imp like using grenades as improvised explosives. So that's what I mean. Hmm. So are there two paths in? Is that it? I presume that's a path in. If Domenego could, like poke. Outside and see a dreadnought there. It's a possible path for the dreadnought to come through, I presume. You want me to lead the dreadnought into the explosives? I don't think so. It's just better to have it if it arrives. Or maybe since, like, I, th I, I doubt crack grenades would do much damage to it, we can just set them up. And they're going to be like a, an alert system to as to where the dreadnought is and how much time we have until it arrives. Okay, basically. well, they just cl apparently closed this giant corridor here. So. Well, they smoked it. You just saw the smoke grenade blast right there. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm establishing the strong point here. Everyone get ready. All right, I'm standing in front of you so that any straight shot... Yeah, well, I also have an invulnerability shield too, so I planted. I, I planted. Just get ready to charge when you got it. Crack grenade mines in that other corridor. Right. You hear the loud thunderous group come this way. Well, I don't see the second one, <clears throat> by the way. I always see the yellow one. Yeah. It's just not visible yet. The book has got to make it visible to us, I think. Yeah. Say again? You need to make a, an aura visible to us. Uh, Yulmunk has like a second aura that he activated. Oh. Uh, shit. Put yourself in the opening. I can't click the past all your stuff. Put yourself in real quick. I can click on you, Eric Ladies. And... Yep. Oh, Ooh, that's big. Yep, that's big. Sixty meters. The small ring is the possibility shield, and the big ring is our uh, squad mode.
And basically, the moment I see anything, I can use a reaction to just go, it, kill it, and everyone gets a plus 20 to hit it. Um, or on my turn, I can use a free action and designate someone the, the kill. Once I designate someone, everyone else can use a reaction to immediately make a standard attack against it. So not full autos, but just like a shot. Well, my heavy bolter doesn't have a single shot. I think can. Uh, so who's in the who's in the corridor currently? Me, and I guess your ladies and uh, new ties. Well, I'm taking cover behind this little corner here as much as I can. Yeah, I've got uh, the left corner. There's a there's a door frame that's right there. So uh, whoever's in the corridor about to be hit. Okay, Domenego. So uh, y every Astartes has a talent called Bulging Biceps. Which allows them to use their heavy weapons in semi, uh, semi-auto. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So all that's what coming I mean? down the corridors. You guys can dodge it. All hit. right. Hold on. Anyone in the corridor is going to be hit by that. So that's going to hit. Uh, it's divided among you guys. So whoever's in the corridor is divided among you guys. The bullets. Eighty. I think it's going to be hitting so my who? leg. Whoever's I'm in the. Setting. Yeah. yeah, so that'd be Karnoth, Neo Tyson, are you taking cover? Yeah, I'm I'm kind of around this corner here. Hmm. So it's just Karnoth eating shit then, right? Yeah, uh, and I eat all of the shit. <laughs> they get a 9.2 success shooting into blind smoke. They got a minus uh, 32. Uh, plus oh. 30. Hold oh, on. I did I plus 30. Them. Oh, doop, derp. Okay, so the 6. It, okay. it would be a 6 instead of a 9. Okay. No, it will be less. Six no, would be they... minus thirty plus another minus three, so a three. So four shots. Okay, so I'll just redo that again. So they fucked up. I meant to mi no, minus. No, it's gonna be minus sixty then. So you it's could... gonna be three shots, uh, four shots yeah. in total. Yep, four shots. Yeah, it'll four be, shots, be in four shots in total. So the so first, the first four, four shots. Uh... I'll just do the... We'll ignore that first one since I messed up. All right. All right. So I think. I... Okay, then three yeah. shots then. So you absorb all that. Better. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on. Uh, I think they're shooting at my right leg. Is that correct? It's eight, so it's going to be like flipped. It's going to be eighty, right? Uh, if you're, are, are you going by the first one or the second roll? Because he he rolled and changed it. Oh, we changed it. Okay, then. Uh, so it is now left arm. Left arm. Okay. Uh, oh, that's actually very good. Three. Five. Okay, that doesn't hit. The second shot does hit. It's gonna be twenty-eight. Um. Uh, on. No. Three eight. Yeah, yeah. Calculator, please. Thank you. There you go. 26. No, 28. Uh, six damage I'm going to take. Sweet. And... Yeah, are you guys going to back up from this corridor, by the way? Or are you guys going to still sit there? Actually, wait, no, well, I strong pointed it up, so I can't move. Okay. Because they're just gonna uh, funnel in into the corridor, but right. Wait, the, oh. um, they smoked off the the room, both sides, and they're just shooting into the room at this point. Mm -hmm. I'm still standing there. No, oh, I know. Uh, how, how, how does the grenade back around that, the corner? Well, that's a grenade, so. How do they how do they throw it? How does it like fly in? Huh? Uh, how? they're lobbing it. I mean, like, where does it land? And like, how is it like? Is it coming from the right side or is it like from from over here? How does it? And where oh. where does it land? Uh, yeah. observation. Well, where does it land? Oh, uh, right behind Karnoff. Oh. 
Is there enough time to pick it up and check it? <laughs> Let me decide. Well, it's a good thing that the blast radius is too small to hit either Karnoff or me. <laughs> yeah, crack grenades have a really small blast radius. Yeah, yeah I know. A, a they have a blast yeah, radius of one. So as long as no one's standing on it, no one gets hit by it. Yeah. Right. So. So it missed everybody. Yeah. You could pick it up theoretically if you move fast enough and chuck it back at him. It's just going to miss us. There's no point in picking it up. Like, if it's chucked and I see that's the crack grenade. Oh. I think I, I would be able. Uh, well. You could. If it flies past me. You could toss it up into the air and then use your chain sword as a baseball bat and punt it back at them. I like that idea. I'm going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, smacking a live grenade with a chain sword sounds like a great idea. Don't worry about it. I got this. Instead <laughs> of grenades. How about, in, how about instead of going through all the trouble of picking up, throwing it in the air, and then smacking like a baseball, you could play golf? When it lands on the ground. Yeah, that's even yeah. better. <laughs> yeah. What do I remember to do? That? You'll get a plus four. Poco. What's up? What do I roll to do that? To throw the grenade back? Uh Let's see. So it has to be really fast. So whatever agility. Minus twenty. Right. He's he's okay, using he's using his chain sword as a golf club to. It's it's a speed check at this point. The speed it's a, a speed, speed check, check to right. see if he can do it. Because I'm not and saying he speed. can't do it. But if you okay. don't hit it, you're gonna take the the full force of that pen 10, 18. So you said minus twenty. Minus twenty. All right. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba -da -ba. Do remember the possibility of shield if you haven't used it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do have a rapid reaction talent, which allows me to act when surprised. But I don't think that's going to apply here, necessarily. Uh, it's pretty surprising. It is surprising, though. Oh, eh, whatever. We ball. <laughs> so, flamers, what is that, an agility thing you have to dodge? Or something yep. like that? So I guess what's the cone on that usually on yours, Moth? Uh I think it's a line. Okay. It's just the a cone line. To, it's 30... a line to its max range, if I remember right. Okay, it's, so the cone is about thirty in like degrees, I think. So anyone, so are you guys gonna start firing back or what are you guys doing here? I mean, we haven't really been given a chance to. It just keeps coming. Hey, yeah, case of damage. Yeah. Hey, case of damage. Hey, case of yeah. damage. Yeah, I did too. So, should we roll initiative? Yeah. All right. Uh, does checking the grenade back do anything to them? Uh, let's see. You you hear a loud grunt, and someone someone in the death throes. Oh, <laughs> damn. Damn, you fucking killed someone with that crack grenade. <laughs> That's incredible. Damn. Might have been the guy I wounded. This yeah. is more impressive than defeating the hive lord tyrant. <laughs> See, all Didn't we really hive... did was throw a big explosion at him and then shoot him a couple of times. I thought the hive tyrant defeated himself and that was all of his underlings. Like they kept... Oh, I'm thinking of the wrong thing. They kept, uh... Shooting at us and then exploding. <laughs> yeah, but... I, mean, I was trying to give you a chance for you guys to make a tactical decision if you guys are going to stay or flee. So we're gonna mm -hmm. tactical decision is we're ambushing them as they come through. Oh, well, they're yeah. not ambushed though. They obviously know you're there. They are ambushing us. <laughs> right. Nobody's ambushing anybody at this point. They just oh, knew you're true. there. That's why they oh well, they they know you're in there, so they're smoking off the area. You guys are not kind of what they're doing. They're setting up. They're they're peeing up a flank on you guys. So are we to take it that all of the black area there is smoke and anything outside of it is visible? So if you can see, you can see him like that. You yeah, can I can him. see him. Right. Yes, it's smoke. That's, that's I did that in purpose. The small circle. So. Alrighty. 
I did say I was on Overwatch, going to shoot anybody that got close that I could see. Yeah, that's on. As long as you need reaction to all this stuff, because he's coming in with a flamer and about to tee up. Uh, he'll dissipate the smoke and hit you guys. Okay, do your damage. Or uh, do your attack. Do your attack. You guys there? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I'm gonna fate point that one. You have point nine. When you get higher, I rolled a ninety-seven. I'm fate pointing that. Okay. Jesus Christ! I just realized that. Wow, that's a high roll. Hello, there we go. Ayo, ninety-seven to seventeen. Ooh, smoked. Let's see, uh, seventy-one. So that's a leg. Yeah, uh, I love shooting out their legs. So <laughs> yeah, he's probably dead. That goes. He has twenty-four. He ignores it's, four damage, so he takes twenty-four to a leg. So he's dead. So you just see him splat, and you just see a big ball of fire in that direction. So obviously, that guy had. No bueno stuff. Yes, but does that fireball take anyone else with him? I It does have blast radius of two meters on it, so if anybody's within two meters of him. No. Damn. <laughs> cool. Well, if we're still in the free form throwing stuff, I'll throw out a... Uh... Oh, well, never mind. I can't see Ooh, did that clear the smoke? It did. Nice. I don't see anybody. That's because I killed the guy who was in here. This Hello, guy over here. Guy. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, there's, there's also, I don't see anything else. <laughs> I was going to throw some spells, but I don't see no one. You can preemptively throw some spells. <laughs> right, because you... I don't know how much... So, I'm assuming dude is going to tell you how many guys went to the left. Right? Well... I, I saw mean, two he, Chaos Marines and one Dreadnought. That's it. Okay. That's what you saw. I mean, I could push the limit. And hit everything in a nine radius meter radius here. Were you, were you striking that? But I don't know where they are. So I don't really want to rule at risk. A pushing the limit roll. Well, let's push the it's limit nice when we see him. Yeah, yeah. Or if we hear explosive from this end, then we kind of know where they are. Yeah, somewhere, anywhere. You gotta get visual on people first. And there ain't no people. Right, so you don't need to do initiative because you don't see anyone. You do do an observation? Plus Awareness roll. Plus Awareness, sorry. Plus 10. Plus 20. More, because we're space marines. There you go. Uh, you hear the faint clattering of feet away from that, that portal. That door opening. They just That space marine just died in. Okay, I'm ready for the dreadnought. I think it's about to approach. <laughs> Hold up. What the fuck? I think my roll 20 just crashed. Yeah. Nice. Are right, the whole. Uh, it took a crash jump all over you. Yeah.
That's what you guys see. What do we see? What do we see? Smoke cleared. Smoke cleared Back over up. down the bottom. Ah. There's a crack grenade minefield in there that they're going to have to dodge. Okay. Oh, so the turn order is no longer visible. All right. If uh, I have a turn, I would like to do something if we have the ability. Yeah, it's it's still free form. All right. You, I'm going to activate a faith power called Spirit of the Martyr. My willpower bonus is now added to our toughness bonus when taking damage. Ooh. What's your willpower bonus? It is five. Holy shit. So if your willpower bonus can... is five, that gives us, what, eight toughness? Because we have three to begin with? Like three. No, that's, that's unnatural. Oh, unnatural. That's unnatural. Okay. Uh, so our toughness bonus is whatever. So, for example, I have 76. My toughness bonus would be seven. Yeah, right. plus an extra five, so now you have 12. Yeah, that's scary. Oh, my God. I'm just gonna do it like this. Oh my god, I have 54 <laughs> armor oh on my, my chest. God. What the fuck, dude? Not dude, dude, I mean dude in general. Hang up. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell. How long the does this last? <laughs> okay. Uh, the rest of this combat encounter. Okay. They're, they're delaying us. Oh, also, all critical damage is suffered is reduced by another one. Okay. <clears throat> also, do we have a medic with us? Nope. So it doesn't look like it. Alright, so how do I use the repair cement on myself it, it just, so I can reduce wounds? It, it doesn't do that. Uh, it's just uh, like a thing to repair your armor, basically. Yeah, if your armor takes damage, you can patch it up. Oh, gotcha. So every damage you take is going to be permanent. Good job. Good luck. So you guys just hear eerie silence. As if nothing happened. I'm still standing there waiting. It's quiet, brothers. Too quiet. The cowards. They can't even fight us. Like, actual. Wait, I see someone. <laughs> or are oh, they trying to stealth? Do I actually see that? You do. He's not stealth. I was trying to do a down symbol. Like, he's on the ground. Like, he's on the. Is he down with anyway, the syndrome? I'm going to use a free Ooh, action to designate now. that guy to murder. So everyone gets a 20 to shoot him. Where is yeah, he? Yeah, he's nice. Yeah, he's he's, uh, he's down, facing down on the ground. Oh, face down on the ground. Oh, that's the one that uh, moth like shot. Moth shot. Never mind. Oh, okay. Ah. He bled out. Or I guess since we're exposed to the vacuum of space, his his armor was punctured too much. Yeah. The. Uh... The rest of his body was sucked out of his suit violently through the leg hole because he blew his leg off. I Not so blown because the higher pressure blows outwards. As far as you can tell, he's still very much alive. Oh, that's even worse. That's going to be one hell of a hickey. <laughs> you guys still okay. holding position? I'm still holding position. I mean, if he's still alive, I'll shoot him again. All right. You still doing that called shot plus 20 on him? Yep. He's the only one I can see, so he's designated to die. <laughs> Do you? Go ahead.
And we'll just say he's we'll just say he's dead. Alrighty. And he just explodes. And you see his body kind of sucked into a portal like the other guy. Are you able to walk through the fire here? It's pretty raging and still going on. So is that a yes? You can try. Well, it damaged me. Uh, it's raging, know. so yes, it would. I mean, it's fire. It, it's a fuel fire. The only way to let it go is to burn it out at this point. Although, there's not really any oxygen in here, so... Don't worry about that. And they're also chaos space marines, so you don't know what it is that they're about to hit it's you with. It's plasma fire. It's burning ions. No? Mm. You don't know. I'm going to go around the Kraken bombs and see if there's anything here. Oh, God. I don't see anything. Okay. Okay, I guess we're going to have to move forward because otherwise nothing happens. But we can stand off like this till the okay, end. Okay, uh, hey, dude. So go ahead and do a dodge check. Uh oh. <laughs> do, I think you passed two. Do two. On fire? Uh, since you're unaware of it, uh, minus 40. Unaware of what? There's nothing here. Take a. They no, didn't like you too. Right. Uh, take 15 with pen 10 to the legs. Or I should say crack my shit. Did you just crack step, on a, step on a crack grenade bomb thing that I placed? No. no. They set up another field on that side too. Oh, shit. <laughs> Trench warfare moment. I'm trying to figure out how many damage that really takes. I have 20 armor. So I'd like to summon St. Hymar and just start artillery barraging the other side. <laughs> so 20 armor, so reduce the armor by 10, so it's 10 armor now. St. Hymar, that's yeah. hilarious. And then, go. okay, so that's 5 damage. Keep, yeah. keep in mind, you still have that plus 5 toughness bonus from me. Your toughness bonus also reduces damage. So, so it's another effectively, five if you're not effectively, uh, that did not hurt me then. Uh, yeah, effectively you can add plus, uh, what is it? Like you add five 15. to damage resistance, more or less. Unless something specifically bypasses toughness. Yeah, so I just run back. In what I've done mind. is effectively add 50 toughness to myself for the purpose of this encounter, because it's just like plus five bonus to toughness bonus. So Technically. All right, Captain. Do we wait? I mean, we have to move forward because otherwise, nothing happens. Yeah, let me go forward and check it out. Yeah, I guess through, through the fires and flames, he treads. No, I, just, I, just, I was standing near. I'm not going through. I'm just standing, okay. there, looking. Was that ACDC through the fire and flames, or is what? It's something else. What? No, no, I think that was a, another band. Uh, don't it's Dragon Force, that. come on. Ah, uh, right, okay. <laughs> ACDC. Get out Our of only, that. I propose luring them into the minefield from the bottom side. I prefer fire by Axel Rudy Pell. Well, regardless of what we do, I basically have to give up the strong point. And uh, we're going to have to move forward. But, uh, Where? well, this is the dangerous way. The other way is a minefield, we've heard now. But yeah. we should be able to spot the mines, so that's probably safer. Unless you want to try and put out a fire. Uh, or Did we, we save any and... of those weird or... alien fire extinguishers? Or they're all sitting up over this way. Did you save any of those? Looking south. No. So if we just run through the fire, fire. Fingers, fingers. they'll never expect it. 
from the yeah, elder those cryo that grenades we found. Chuck. No, we the wizard took all of it. He took yeah. everything. Any anything yeah. he took. Damn. Yeah. He took the weapon. <laughs> all of it. Dude, the so fucking run, fire you run the fire? Is so stupid. Who's gonna run through the fire? Uh, I was, I was saying that uh, if the fire service cut off our, if they think it's cut off our access, then they may have moved to the northeast, facing south, expecting us to come from the south. How? Uh, okay. How quickly does cement paste come out of our the, the tubes we have or whatever it is stored? We can use that to basically cover the flames, I presume. Hold on. Can I make a check to find out what's causing the flames? Yeah. I think we already know. It's the guy with the flamethrower who we blew up, right? <laughs> yes, yes. But I'm wondering if he died holding the trigger down and he's just gouting a thing of fire. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. So you're right, doing so observation? This... Yeah, yeah. Any bonus to this? Uh, are you using any of your face stuff? Are you using any uh, any any other thing in your observation as you're looking at? Or are you just looking physically for something? I'm just looking and listening. Okay, cool. Uh, plus twenty. And plus, plus fifty, it machine. is. And I have heightened senses, hearing, and sight. Sweet. So there we go. Nine point six. So you're looking at it, you don't see anything that would logically make sense why this fire is still burning. But it's still burning. Uh, as far as the body being there, there's no body left. It charred right through all of it. Burned right through all of it. All right, so... Psyker shenanigans. Like, no, it's not a good idea. I can't see any fuel source. Psyker shenanigans. All right. I would like to chuck a frag grenade... Or just into... warp fire. I want to chuck a frag grenade into the center of the fire to see if the blast wave will dis dissipate it. Extinguish it. Can I do that? You can try. All right. Oh my god. Uh oh. You throw it to I didn't need the fire as a target. You get a plus twenty. <laughs> <laughs> so at, plus ten from the possibility shield. As you do that, what's the explosion radius of that grenade? Uh, uh okay, it is. Oh, it's five. like two meters or three meters. Okay, so the it's fire. It's also not great. Five. Yeah, five it, meters. Eight. Yeah, the fire gets bigger and splatters across the walls, the ground. God damn it. Whatever that liquid was, it spread further. As on what liquid? You said there was fire. no fuel source. Not a fuel source that you understand. Like, it's a liquid. It doesn't look like fuel that burns and dissipates, if that makes sense. <laughs> uh. here's, here's something stupid. I would like to unfettered... Uh, Sharky fly uh, that area and try and smother it with sharks. Sharks? <laughs> well, you know, my, my Jaws ability that crushes everything okay. and tries to pull Don't it those sharks pop out of, like, liquid? I politely move back. Well, it's Put more like a psychic giant, fire with psychic water. It, it's Great more like idea. a giant shark jaw that clamps down on the entire area and pulls everything in. Okay, ah. cool. That's really gonna eat like the what's fire. Happening. She's going to eat the fire for breakfast. Go Lunch for it. And dinner every day of the week. It's gonna be a little spicy. And you're doing this psyker thing? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, it's a six meter radius uh, in the center of the fire. Okay. Well, you see that giant shark pop out. And you see those flames. It splatters them all the hallway as it's chomping and doing its thing. Oh my god. This it was a six meter fire. radius in the center of the fire, pulling everything towards the ground and in the center of it. But okay, I'm I'm aware. Okay, I'm aware of what you're doing. I know what, I know exactly what you said, but this is what happens. All right, through the minefield we go. Sorry, yes, sir. Breaking strong point. Ugh. Does your guy have any knowledge of chaos or any bullshit like that? Your character would. You can do any psychic uh, bullshit on that uh, fire there. 
It would be Forbidden Lord Xenos, right? Right. Uh, I'll roll for that. Sword Fire okay. isn't necessarily a psychic power. So. Okay, so you guys wouldn't have... Okay, cool. Yeah. Like, like if a psyker had set up that fire, I could extinguish it. But if it's just warp flamer fuel, I can't do anything against that. Sweet. Oh, sorry. Oh, uh, so, uh, Neil Tyson, your guy sort of heard of some forbidden stuff like this, the all chaos tech. Um, well, it wouldn't be Xenos, though. Yeah, that wouldn't be Xenos yeah. warp. So. So what would that be? Heard of it. So the more you attack it or try to extinguish it, the more it grows. So the best bet is to leave it be. Damn. I relay that information. That is, it is, it has destroyed whole worlds, this fire. Oh, God. I have read of this in the librarian. Better not dwell on it. Nice. Maybe we'll destroy this whole... Wait, Actually, I was going to say, wait a second. What if we just keep attacking it? No, because we need to get the cylinder. Oh, that's right. This ain't a destroy mission. This is a recover mission. You could. Yeah. yeah. All right. Just plant a nuke on it and walk away. Done. Yep. And, you you and solved you, our problem. <laughs> right. And your character would know, Karnoff, that uh, this will never be extinguished. It'll burn for all eternity. It's indistinguishable. Inextingu <laughs> Wait, no. <laughs> <laughs> From what? Regular fire? <laughs> Just, 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 just in general. From a regular in, fire. No, in, inextinguishable. Inextinguishable, yeah. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. No, oh I said? My God. No, no, I said I said indistinguishable. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Why the fuck would it burn for all eternity, though? That's stupid. That's warp stuff. Don't worry about it. Oh, God. He caught the warp itself on fire in that one localized patch. Ah. All right. Start looking for mines and be on the lookout for anyone hiding to take a shot. Alrighty then. I am looking for mines. I see nothing. Okay, you proceed forward, I imagine. 2.9, what do I see? 4. 1.9. Okay, uh, I'll start marking mines. And this one seems to be a proximity mine. You observe it. So you have to destroy it or disarm it. Uh, I go near the pipe. I would and like to rip out a small piece of pipe and throw it at the mine to trigger it. Okay. Trigger it. All right, what do I roll for that? Uh... All right, modifiers. Uh, give you a plus twenty. I succeeded. Hey, okay, cool. Uh, giant ball of acid explodes in all directions. Oh, the warp wall. acid! That's gonna burn for all eternity. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, Sorry, melt for all eternity. No, but it melts to the floor. For all Pretty strong enough. No. So now, so now there's a gaping hole in the floor. In the floor. Oh yeah. God, it melted through reality. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first bomb disabled. It's careful now. He may just do that. If he he to be enough, we will do. Yeah, we will, we will do. Right, let's see. Thing. Let's see if we can go through. If there, let's check if there's a vent here, and see if we can go through there. Let's go around gotta, the shenanigans. I gotta keep checking for more mines. Agreed. Uh, that fails. Check the pipes see. and see if we can then, Dominego. See if the pipes have mines in them. Right. Right. Just, I'm not see sure if, if we smart. can move through them. So, Karnoff, you don't see a mine. And Dominego, we, we doing that pipe. This pipe, when you look at it. Okay, so this I'm, pipe, I'm look looking at for uh, mines up here, is what I was rolled there. Okay, cool. So you found this mine. And Dominego, when you look at this pipe, it's actually uh, radiating heat off of it. Like something's flowing through it. So this is a heat pipe, probably. 
or an active fuel pipe? I'm going to um, roll a tech use to determine what kind of pipe that is and if it's active. Sure. Modifier? Plus 20. Plus 20, okay. Hey, oh. So, you look <coughs> at this, and you look at the other team, you look at it again, tell them this shouldn't even be, there shouldn't be anything flowing through this thing. What uh, is there? As far as, it's, a, it's normally for, like, waste disposal and other things. There shouldn't be anything hot flowing through like it is. Ah. Uh, because they really is, hate coffee. This is yeah. the pipe where the uh, Chaos Marines fluff their shit. Well, yeah, so, and it's, the, the pipe itself is red hot. And it's red hot. Damn. Yep, like the pipe is, uh... They all have flaming shits. They must have eaten Taco <laughs> Bell. Oh, so that's what they fueled the flamer with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder it sank so bad. No wonder it burns for all eternity. <laughs> Indeed. Here we go. <laughs> uh, oh, is shit. there a vent nearby as well? No. You don't see anything of that nature. Perhaps their chaos gods were too spicy. <clears throat> All right. Uh dude. Uh, what would you do? How would you do something? Uh, logic, uh, right? Probably, probably logic. Could do logic, yeah. scrutiny. Um, yeah, one of those two. Do one of those scrutiny, do or logic. logic. Let's do a logic. Modifier. Yeah. Uh, plus twenty. All right. <laughs> That's a success, technically. They ate Taco uh, Bell. Uh, the pipe's hot, so you're concluding that there someone's flushing something in the system that should not be there. The only thing you can draw from that. Okay. I uh, relay this information. Well, I don't recommend opening something that's being flushed by warp. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Let's keep clearing the mines and slowly progress forward. It seems to be our only viable path. Right. And then Dominic goes as you walk away, do an awareness check minus six. Awareness check what? Minus 16. Oh, hold on. I've got a better idea. I'm just going to, fettered, do um the jaws just. Every four meters. Okay. Uh, and because it's feathered, uh, I never have to roll on the table. Um, I'm back up. I'm going to check our six. So you trigger all the mines in the hallway? Yeah. <laughs> Except that time. But yeah, I'm just going to basically just keep spamming it out. That's also a double, though. Yeah, I'm okay. fettered. Fettered doesn't... If I do it right. fettered, I, uh, it doesn't matter what the roll is. So, uh, the next mine that you destroy, you see kind of that similar fire explode in all directions. Oh, so we're just stuck here now. The warp fire thing? Yeah, the warp fire. The warp fire from the other, you saw it explode from that mine. Okay. They really, really wanted to trap you guys. They did not like you guys. Not trap, but like isolate, control, and dominate, and then uh, do it. Someone do a do Adeptus Astartes lore. Hey, I think I might have found a way to circle around. So Neil Tyson, you succeeded. You know yep. that they're about to, instead of direct fight you guys, they're gonna flush you out by probably explosives. It's what you got. You got your team to do. So Did sticking you around. Say flush. Is that what they're using <laughs> yeah. this pipe what? for? <laughs> Flushing napalm. Or more of that bullshit shit they have. Or warp fire. Yeah. 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 More warp fire. Oh my god. 
does it does the fire reach all the way up to the ceiling? Okay, so uh, no. back the way we came through the void, yep. there is another pathway. Yeah, we backtrack. should do that. Let's get the fuck out of here. Agreed. Right. So I was it? They're trying to lure you guys into trap. They were not going to rush a stronghold. So your characters know it's stupid to do that, even with the dreadnought. Oh, hey, look, it's the tunnel again. So are you guys checking for mines along the way? Yep. yep. Yeah. Okay. You see no mines in that hallway. I step out and I turn to the right. And Demay, are you checking for mines too? As you... Yes. Making sure... I know what happened last time. Oh, you got the, you, your mind check? No? Yep. All right. Let me mark it. Right there. The doorway. Oh, there's the warp fire. So it is around the other side. Yep. So I suggest we try and step around the mine rather than <laughs> triggering it. And Parnoff and... And uh, Versara, you're checking for mines too. Yep. We get that. Okay. On our side, yep. Okay. Uh, you're a you're a check. You got minus one on. Oh man. Nope, nope. That was that was before before we went into this hallway here. Okay, cool. Then do Here's that. The next check then. Mine was after going into this hallway. So one there. One Ooh. there. Ooh. One there. And. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> You, you, Moth. You notice that these these mines, they are they are now triggered, armed, primed. Should not move. Oh, problem. <laughs> <laughs> I'm using a G right. GM overlay. I already set these mines before you guys did anything. So, right. gotcha. Okay, okay. Um, okay. I'm going to right, come right. around and try and defuse the mines. I'm gonna get ready to jump back because uh, yes, right. get ready to do that. track record on demolitions. <laughs> All right, so there's what demolitions to uh, defuse. Is that it? Yep, minus fifty on the first one. Minus fifty. <laughs> oh, yes. we're so fucked. Oh my god. Wait, 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 I'm in the possibility, possibility shield. shield. Possibility shield. No. Got it. I'm you in the possibility shield. Oh. That means I got oh, yeah. it. Okay, yeah, cool. it's a point nine. Woo! All right. Okay. First mind to say. It's a point one. He got it by point one. Oh, sorry. Point so point this one, guy's man. gone, right? Yep. All right. That's gone. All right. All right. And I presume this one is also primed, right? Yep. And they're both probably primed. Probably this one too. Oh, they're all primed. Okay. Yeah. And. You guys want to know what kind of mines they are? You're going to observe what they are? You just uh, know. I'll take a look at them, sure. Uh, like, uh, be. Awareness. <laughs> no, it'd be a lore of some sort. Uh, oh, then never mind. Adeptus Mechanicus, Archaeotech, any of those? Or Imperium lore. Yeah, either of those work. Imperium. Do I have Imperium lore? Yeah, because these guys are basically almost like Imperials. I don't know what they are. I'm going to do Mechanicus lore. Neil Tyson, when you looked at them, these mines are like the acid mine, the other one. These are very ancient mines from All right. the before times. So. Brothers, they're very ancient mines. You're, you're not quite sure who made them, other than they're old tech. You've only seen them in museums where you were trained. <laughs> um, ancient mines? You, Can we get them to talk? Mines. <laughs> Not mine. No, mine. mine. They can't uh, talk. <laughs> no, uh, but you do know that these things are very devastating to armor. You do not want these going off. Especially I in the relay the of information space. to everyone that these are not to be trifled with. And <clears throat> these specifically are uh, stealth layer mines. So they wait until the enemy is kind of within the last radius circle. Prime, and then your motion set off to explode. Brother Ericlades, please come closer so that you may shield me with your possibility shield. 
All right, so now that uh, I know what kind of mines he's are, do I get a bonus to uh, defeat plus him? 10. Plus, plus 10. 10. Plus that's 10. Plus 10. total? Uh, total right? will be minus 40, then. Okay, so okay, minus so 30 minus is possibility. 30, All right. Okay, I'm fate pointing this. Okay. Another plus 10. Uh, yes. So minus 20 minus now. 20. Oh my god. I'm a fate point again. Because <laughs> it will go if, if it will go off. Oh, okay. 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 Finally. So I diffused uh, the top one of the two here. And I'm gonna work on oh, the future. Moth, you're free to move. You're free to move now. I don't know that, do I? Brother, you're free to move now. Sister, you're free to move yeah. now. He he tells you you're free to move because they're they're primed to do whatever the target walks into it. So I was, those two were primed on you. You're free right. to move. Karnoth has a mind primed on him. All right, I'm gonna try and defuse Karnoth's one. Minus 30. Oh my god, I'm fate pointing that. Alright. Karnath, are you going to help him uh, fate point that as well? If he fails this next one? Uh, if he can have all of the uh, fate points he, he wants. To. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, he looks like he's taking one. <coughs> yeah. That was a 99. Jesus. Fuck. Yeah, it was. It All was right. a 98 followed by a 99. Don't roll 100 next. Oh, God. All you need to do is roll a 40-something. No. Whoa. <laughs> no. 83. One less. All right. Let's do it again. So another, op another option is for Karnoff to just move and eat and try to dodge out of that damage. Hey, oh, never mind. Unneeded. There we go. Hey. Now we've got three ancient proxy acid mines. Ooh. Yeah. Yep. You're right. So I'll give you stats on them. Uh, it is. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna. I'm gonna remove them to my into my inventory. Our ancient uh, acid, acid mine. chaos mine. Ancient acid chaos mine. All right. Class, that would be what? Energy? Uh, I guess it would be energy. I don't know how you classify. Yeah, that's energy. Yeah, energy. Uh, range is 10. Damage is 2d10 plus 5. No pen. And it dissolves armor. So, whatever damage it does, it actually deducts from armor points. I don't know what all right. special that is, but it does. That's all it does. Oof. So it would have been a no bueno, you guys. Alright, so I'll walk back up here and I'm going to look for more mines. Okay. Alright, here we go. Got it. One there. Hello, crit success with the nat one. So you're nice. able to see this mine, this mine, mine. Wow, you see all the mines with that. So you can, you can, you can disarm them, try to go around them. Uh, you're not quite sure. Like, huh? I would like to pick up uh, my frag grenade and throw it without priming it at one of the mines. Just oh, like won't that set them off? Keep in mind, one of the other mines was the, uh, the fire warp mine. Fire, yeah, the warp fire mine. You run the chance of it being one of those. I don't think oh, we want to trigger these. All right, fine. Because they, because they could be. You've encountered uh, the crack mine that uh, dude ran over, an acid, and a chaos flame mine. So my question is, are they positioned in such a way that we can shimmy around them without getting within their radius? 
their trigger radius. So, Moss character looking at them, he doesn't know how they're triggered. He doesn't know anything other than that uh, these are very well concealed, but he's he's able to distinguish where they're at. So that's all the information you have. You don't know what they are, how they're triggered, or any of that stuff. But you do know, uh, based off your previous experience, one's a direct walkover, which the dude ran over. Another one is uh, proximity, delay, which is the acid one. And then um, the, the flamer, which was the motion. As soon as you walk into it, it goes off. So those are the three you know of. So those are your three options of what they could be. Okay, so fire would just be proximity, so... I'm betting the top one's fire, of anything. If it's proximity, we can check. We can toss something at it. What are you betting on it? Your life? <laughs> I'll bet this small sheet of metal, and I fling it over like a frisbee to the top one. Frank, check. Oh, this is going to go well. That's the wrong one. That went real well. 99. 99? Yeah, I rolled the 99. I was trying to check. Your character goes to toss it, and it falls behind her. Like, you know, when you do a little trick with the dogs, and it falls behind your back. That's what happens. I look at Look, it. guys, I threw it really far. Yeah, I, you're I looking go. for it. You don't even look behind you. <laughs> I pick up that sheet of metal, and then I toss it. Strength check. No modifiers. No modifiers. No modifiers. No Oh, it's actually plus one because it's a plus ten because of the possibility shield. So I do succeed. So that would be <laughs> how do you hero. You barely <laughs> succeed. Here you go. Let me show you how to pick up the small metal stick. <laughs> and you're tossing in the grenade and you see it splatter as, as it hits the mine. Oh. Easy peasy. You're gonna wait for it to oh. dissipate and then jump over the hole. May as well. I'll also check for other mines in the area around here. Okay. Mm. Okay. Do you know other mines? All right. Alrighty. I'll check down this hallway, see if I see any mines then. Okay. This one up back here. 20 meters. Now let's see. How does leaping work? You see no mines? Hey guys, this hallway looks clear. I assume you go around through the smaller passageways. They probably won't expect it. They had to leave a way for themselves to get out, didn't they? Yeah, but they still would have planted a mine. So watch it. Well, I haven't checked out the rest of this hallway up here, so watch yourselves. I got one success on this hallway. No mines. Ooh, I see all the mines. Yeah, you walk They're in everywhere. there. Oh my god, don't go in there. There's so many mines, guys. No, you go in there. And, I rolled a uh, hundred, Boko. I rolled a hundred. I'm aware. I'm giving you... You're going there. Walk in there. Just amazed at these godlike beings stepping on every single mine and not getting obliterated. God, you guys are so lucky. Or, right. Then you lose the definition of what a mine is. So, no. As you walk in this room, <laughs> off the point out... Oh my god. Oh, I we went to the left? Oh, oh whoop. Uh, hi, hello. Oh, don't hi. get back here. Get back in the hallway. <laughs> so, get back in the hallway. So, so oh, Moss. So many. Did someone so, say mines? Yes. Uh, right, so Moss, yeah, they, they, this is your negative 100. So you go in there, you look at, oh, mine, 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 mine. You see all those mines. Oh, well, what about the rest of us? Well, the rest of you guys. Yeah, can, can we? 
can we do a yeah. check? Domin no, yeah, I don't you, say anything. Uh, so Dominagus and Karnoth, you believe Moss character. Uh, who yeah, rolled? I got a oh three point two, and Dominego got a four point six on this. I'm re-rolling it. You, you don't see any mines. You do. Okay. You see no obvious mines. That fits the other thing. The ten point three. Jeez. Holy shit. Jeez. Oh, why are you re-rolling? Or oh, you the fate point? Yeah. Yeah. You also don't see any mines. In fact, it looks very clear in this room. You're actually using your scanners and other things to search through all the spectrum to see if you see any of those mines. You use your knowledge but that you learned throughout your career as a tactical marines that this technically doesn't make any sense to mine this area. Is it a mine? It's a mine mines, guys. They're playing so, games on you. Let's just move on. There's, there is no mine here. <laughs> is there here. one right here? No. <laughs> oh, God. I step on this mine. I, I take cover waiting for the there? explosion. <laughs> nope. No mind. Oh, I'm now just we, casually walking. <laughs> now we step on each Is there one here? Oh now my god, thank god these mines are so old. Now we step on each individual <laughs> like mine just to fuck with the moth's character. Yeah. Right. <laughs> uh, they used all the crap mines here. Thank, thank the Emperor. The Emperor okay, protects. enough horsing <laughs> around. Let's focus up for this next bit. Uh, keep an eye out for mines, because, uh, you know, just in case. Yeah, I uh -huh. failed. I failed. Mine is all torture. Hey. Remember, you guys have plus, additional plus 10 with that um, possibility thing. shield. Oh, well, that, yeah, I, I keep forgetting my own possibility shield. Yeah, so I succeed. Plus, <laughs> yeah, plus you have a normal. So, whoever succeeded, you see no mine. mine. Everyone else, but forget for myself. Right, and whoever else failed, you see a mine. Well, I technically succeeded. Right. So anyone who failed, you see him. Okay. So anyone who failed, it's all mine. Alright, is there anything in this here? Room. I passed. Say again, what room? The pink one. room. No mines there. And this room. I also passed. I also passed. Hold up. Well, you just shoved yourself into the room, so... Yeah, no mines there either. <laughs> Face checking the room for mines, good plan. I mean... It worked before. Clearly, there, there, there's no mines here. I don't know what you're, what you're worrying about, Brother Ericlides. Okay, are you checking on that? You checking on the halls? Okay, give Pace me one. makes waste, Karnoff, and a dead space marine. I am quite dense. Don't worry about that. Mine. I can take a dense. hit. I can take a hit. For dominating. Yes, but can you put out an eternal fire that burns you forever? And then, the librarian, are you checking in that hall corridor in the other room for mines? Oh, we need to find is eternal water. No, I, I only checked the room I was in currently, but yeah, okay. this tiny corridor. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. To put out the chaos fire, we need holy water. Chaos water. Yep. 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 I definitely that. tell if there's mines or not in this hallway. The tiny hallway, but yep. you see. Nope, you wouldn't see any mines. Okay. There's nothing okay. here. Not nothing in this corridor, no. So you're gonna go down to the next door and look in the room? Yep. Ooh, Neil Tyson, are you just charging in there? Uh no. <laughs> <laughs> so Karnoff sees it. Car Karnoff! It triggered on you again as soon as you open that oh. door. Walk in. Uh oh. It. It's armed. It's. <clears throat> All right. Get your so. fate points ready, guys. I'm gonna disarm the bomb. So this one. Minus. 50. Minus fifty. Okay. All right. I'm in the possibility shield. So minus forty. 
Good God. Sorry, I mean God Emperor. Um, Any more fate yeah, points? Anyone point. has? Yeah, take mine. Alright. Hey! Oh. Easy as that. So the duality of roles. As you pick this one up, this one has like little. Looks like demonic legs. You don't know how to describe it. Looks like mechanical legs. It's a spider mine. A vulture must have been through here. Are you holding it still? Uh, I mean, I diffused it. Yeah, that's fine. And as you, you're picking it up, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, those little claws dig into your hand. Ah, fuck. I I'm gonna do. It down immediately with my hand. Like a, what like? Uh, okay, who, pick, who, who picked it up? I, the I picked it up. Back. <laughs> that's right. So it's a Tesseract's hand, or what did you, you disarm it with? Your little robotic arm? Your main hand? I mean, yeah. I guess it'd be my main hand. Okay. And the one you replaced with the robot arm? Yeah. Yeah. So it, it dug into that. Oh, so it dug into my robot arm. So it didn't yep. hurt. Oh, no, it didn't hurt at all, but it definitely uh, bore into it. Chink. Nothing and can fix, it's okay. You have no idea what it is. Uh, uh, fighter mine. You're I wonder if I could spank an Imperial Guardsman with this. <laughs> oh, I was thinking you were going to say, I wonder if I can spank a, a mine, but okay. Oh. Are you going to spank the mine? No. Oh. Absolutely the fuck not. But, well, but yeah, yeah. Uh, upon seeing that is this mine bore into your hand, you can go hand. I will attempt to uh, s swipe it with my, I guess. Oh God! Not. Sword. May I make I a think... suggestion? Yeah. What? Yeah. Cut off his hand. You know, I was thinking about that. He could just replace it. It's already mechanical. I would like to not do that yet. I'm just gonna attack the mine, basically. Just oh my god. Do like a, no, just don't to attack the mine. So, uh, use logic check there. Uh, that's right. I would like to like like attack its legs and pour into... Alright, what am I uh, gonna do for the modifier on this? Uh, plus, plus 20. And same for me? No, for... No. That's right. He, he's, I just, he's, oh. doing I just a, logic he's it. He's discerning it. Right, he's gonna discern what you're about to do. Um, knowing what you know about some spider mines, you know that would be a bad idea to attempt to cut the legs off, even though you diffuse the trip. Uh, any attempt to dismantle the mine like that would probably set it off. Alright, I'm going to tell Karnoff that. And I'm Otherwise, also going to call that... him a nincompoop for suggesting that he <laughs> smack the mine. Because... While you were like, w once you said it, I was already mid swing, so I stopped, basically. Right. <laughs> so, like but, but this being a chaos spider mine, you have no idea how this thing operates. Um, you just know in general, cutting legs bad. Ooh, it's chaos, right? Yep. All right, I'm gonna try something dumb. Hopefully, doesn't kill everybody. <laughs> uh oh, I make way for that was last great words. Last words. <laughs> if it's chaos, that probably means it's vaguely demonic or warp entity in some way, right? Yes. Yes. Possibly. Yes. So I'm a repel demon on it. Oh. Okay. Any creature of the warp, such as a demon, must win the opposed willpower test. To approach the faithful close to the three times the willpower bonus in meters. Okay. Well, here's the thing. It's already on him, so he doesn't have to get yeah. any closer. Yeah, it doesn't have to move. No, but it must run away from me. Ah, okay. Mmm. Okay. Do it. It's an opposed willpower test, so it has to roll two. It doesn't have a will. <laughs> and I guess it, it just auto succeeds. fails the mind. Yep. Auto you just fail. do something, and the mine's still just in his hand. Damn. I failed the will protest anyway. <laughs> right. 
So you're able to discern that it's not a demonic entity of any kind. It is. Dang. Brother uh, Karnoff, um, off with my hand. You got it. I strike his hand. Yes, he cut okay. through my uh, mechanical wrist, separating the HP? hand. How much HP does it have? Like, what's its toughness? Is it the uh, same as an armor? I would guess that it's arm. This Lay low, the heretic brother. Relinquish that sinful hand that smacketh the bottoms of others. <laughs> 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 it's not the same hand, though, I think. Was, is it? It is. It, it's, the, oh, uh, it is? Okay. it's the left. It would be the I'm left. I'm assuming you're... You could probably take your time and just cut it off the chain sword. We're not yeah. Do any rolls or anything like that. I'm assuming that's All what right. you're doing. Yeah. I just got it off then. Yep. Okay. So it's off. Yep. Uh, using my other hand, I daintily uh, don't grab... touch it again. No. Just use using my other hand. I grab my severed hand, being careful not to touch the mine, and I throw so... it into the minefield. As, oh. as, as you pick up this line, this thing detaches from the hand, crawls to your hand. Oh my god. Uh, uh, can I use rapid you. reaction? Uh, yes. uh, I have a talent called rapid reaction, yep. Yep. <clears throat> can I have a faint point, please? <laughs> sure, I'll give you one. Oh, Thanks. God. Yes. Okay, great. So you're going to smack uh, with your sword? Yeah, I'm going to smack it. Just like with the with the flat of my sword, just kind of like a ding, just like away from okay. playing golf. You ding it, and it hits the wall and explodes. The like crack grenade explodes. Damn. Oh. We, oh. I thought that was going to be more vicious. It's just a crack grenade. A uh, chaos crack grenade. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> so it, feels, so, it <laughs> so what? It feels like four more damage. Uh, it put a mighty hole in that wall. Ah. You can observe observe it, see what kind of damage it did. You know, yeah, are... I will observe and try and compare it to the other cracking mates I've seen go off. Okay. So you know, without a doubt, this thing would have put a damn hole in the, their, these guys' space marine armor. Oh. oh, either a damn hole or like, it would have been very painful for everyone involved. So, a lot more potent, more potent than right, than uh, you know, crack grenades. Would you relay that information? Yes. All right, then I chuck out a frag grenade and I throw it at the rest of the mines. They might have oh. made some other mines and trigger. The firebomb. <laughs> They're all warp mines, from what I can gather. Like, from what I think. Uh, the has uh, our tech marine said that, that they're all warp mines? No. I don't think we looked at them. No. You only look, You only destroyed one mine. Are you still doing that action? Do they all look the same? Uh, indistinguishable from one another, all the mines you've encountered. All right, then I ask the tech marine if they're all warp mines or not. Uh, I'm gonna do a Adeptus Mechanicus roll, or should I do tech use? Well, you see, the mines painted green are the acid mines, and the mines painted uh, red are the fire. Yeah, they don't, they're not orcs, they're not gonna do that, so. Oh, okay. Then, then it's the little, then it's the little fire symbol that carved into them, or the little acid drop right. symbol. All right. It's the demonic rune that's carved into it. If you look at it for even slightly longer than a second, you go insane. Right, so, but it does tell you what it is. Like, once it's fire, but in demon. Yeah, yeah, yeah as it yeah. burns its knowledge into your skull. Right, yeah. so... Uh, Tesseract, you've not seen these mines in a long time other than the museum, uh, but these look like... <laughs> Chaos Legion mines. Um, they're going to be indistinguishable from one another for a reason. And they're going to be various booby traps of sorts that when you go to disarm go to so they're very 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 dangerous these very mines dangerous. are very dangerous uh then that's all you know uh, that's all i know that, they're, they're indistinguishable from one another for a reason 
So people like you get trapped into getting killed. I mean, they might still be proximity based, so even if we yeah. go through, they might still trigger. Like, regardless, we might be trapped here. Yep. It's very, it's very. Right over here. It's it's good to tr maybe trigger the maps, uh, the the mines, so that we don't get hit by them on the way out or something. Or I don't know. Good, good uh, precaution. Seems like a good idea. Yeah. Maybe might want to back up first. That's what I'm doing. Uh, yeah. Yoink. Hold on, where is it? Ah, uh, multicolor. Here I come. So, and you're. <laughs> I uh, I jump for cover. Yeah, your grenade kind of hits the wall, backfires, and lands somewhere and explodes. Does nothing. I'm gonna check in another one. <laughs> yep. Okay, so you set the first mine off. This one. Or in... Yep. All right. Big old acid pool. The other ones. It melts all the other mines harmlessly, and they do nothing. You, the, those two melt. Yes. Eh, good enough. <laughs> this last one, though. Huh. Hold up. Uh, that was a void weapon mine, and we all die now. No, nothing like that. Oh, so that one's, oh, so I can't. Yes. The, mine, can't the mine triggers a boulder shoot above us, and rocks fall, and everyone dies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, nothing like that. Bless it. It is so hard to click sometimes. Yeah, you can just move the green square away and then click on the mine. Or nah, on, this, on the blue like mine. One. Because it, it's like just overlay issue. You just need to move the green. Gr green uh, That's all screen. right. So, this one, you see it like a wall of flames. Just shoot up. Like a, almost, almost like an energy barrier flame. Oh. It's it's very different than the other flame that you dealt with. So it goes up to the ceiling of the roof and just sits there. And it fizzles, and it fizzles, and it dissipates. Great. Awesome. Mm -hmm. I'm moving back. Are you going to relay the information to them? I mean, I presume they can see that. Okay. Uh... It if they can't, like, would would you be guys able to see that? Would you? Would uh, you uh, and yeah, Neil Tyson and Shark would. Yeah, I can see that. Shark. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, then, then I would not uh, really. Still one mine left out there, right? Yep. I'm going to throw a frag grenade on it. Uh, okay. Throw a frag grenade on that last mine. Uh, let's see. Where is it? Here we go. Oh, my God. It goes in the acid pool. I throw another frag grenade. Oh my god. <laughs> that too goes to the ass pool. I throw another frag grenade. Oh my god. That too god. also goes to the ass pool. <laughs> <laughs> How many grenades you got? I'm to going right. to stop you throwing grenades now. I know your left hand is gone, but come on. I'm going <laughs> I to stay <laughs> silent through one. It was his good hand. <laughs> Of those flames, the other flames. Oh my god! Off, off that entire room. Fuck. So that way is no go now. God, how do we? How are we supposed to get out of here? Well, there's, there's a there's passage over here. There's, there's probably, probably enough there. space for us to have walked around that one, but all too late now. It might be, it might be proximity based. We don't know. 
Well, there's a, a pipe here that we can investigate. Okay, investigate. Is there actually a investigate button? It's been a there's while. Also, there's also some grates, too. It'd be observation. Uh, uh, scrutiny. Modifier. Plus 20. Are there any holes in the ceiling? As you look at the ceiling, you don't see many holes. It's very dark, dank. Uh, it's oh god. And for you, Dominagus, uh, as you're searching that pipe, it looks rusted out. I think it was a water main of some sort. Possibly crawl through it. Not sure where it goes. Are you also investigating the grates below you? The other grate? Yeah. Do uh, I need to search on that too? No, you should. I will cover it. Uh, okay. Those those grates were are big enough for Brasor to go through. Uh, as for you, as far as you guys know, Brasor, I think I found another um, path for you. Oh, neat! So, how about this water pipe? I don't know where that one goes, either. Well, nobody knows where anything goes here, so. Oh, I say Tyson we take might. the route we can all go, at least. You know, Tyson might know. I might know what? I imagine the water pipe leads to a water tank. Alright, I'm gonna do what? Would that be tech use on the water pipe? No. Do Codex Astartes. Okay. Hey... Why would you cut Astartes on the water pipe? Because I want to see... I want to figure out, like, where this would go. It would go <coughs> to... A, and like you said, a water tank. It'd be, it's going to be a centralized location deeper in the ship. So if he were to go in that pipe, it would take him a while. But he would emerge in a, an un, unknown room. I say we should guys. take the pipe. I agree. Place. They know where we're coming, but if they don't know where this leads, neither do we, then it might lead to our advantage. We take the pipe. I, would like I dive first. into the pipe. Search oh, okay, for mines I'll, I'll on go the way. In second. Yeah, I'll go in second. Hey, can I mask like you guys? Yeah, yeah, you can draw a box. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, yeet. One second, oh, you, guys wow. get, you guys are going to still get yeeted. Okay. Yeet? Is that everyone? I believe I can so. see nothing. Ah. I'm here. Top, top right, top, top right. Top right. Ah, okay. Uh, Neil Tyson is missing, I think. No, I'm... Wait. Oh, I am missing. Where you are could you? Just be under someone. Or not. He's dead. I presume you he's can see gone. I got right lost. Here, I right? took a wrong we've, turn. We've lost him somewhere in the pipes, brothers. We gotta go back. <laughs> oh, God. He looked, He went left instead of right for the pipe at the beginning. I'm going back. I went into the uh, Taco Bell diarrhea pipe by accident. Oh, no. <laughs> there you right, go. No one's smelling. There it is. He's not, he's not a sticky tech. <laughs> no, that's a water main. So you guys come out, you guys emerge. It looks like this room has not been. No one's been here in a little, quite some time. Quite some time. Yeah, we're still gonna do awareness just in case. Yep. Those mines got you thinking, didn't they? Grumble, grumble, grumble. Grumble, grumble. <laughs> yeah, no mines. Oh, I presume we, we lose the bonus you gave us, Brasora? Uh, yes. I, it depends on if the encounter is over or not. I'd imagine it is. Yeah. Alright. Toughness one was gone. No more plus five damage resist. You guys don't see anything as you're walking through? Jeez.
No mines of any kind? Everyone do uh, awareness check. Yeah, Minus reading. 20. Minus 20. Fuck. <laughs> I pass. Oh, I Okay. I pass with fine colors. I do not pass, Ben. Okay, so the ones that pass. Oh yeah, they... my possibility shield. I also passed. Sweet. <laughs> oh wait, no, is... technically I do. I do pass then. Yep, I do technically <laughs> pass. So everyone who's passed. Everyone you guys except hear... me passes. Right. So you guys hear very faintly, like on the opposite side of the ship, it seems. We guys at giant explosion, some sort, definite explosion. That probably came Jewish. from our. Previous position. Remember that hot pipe? That probably just burst. Oh. So stinking over there. We probably want to yeah. move on before the stink comes here. Yeah. <laughs> Cover your noses. <laughs> oh man. Wait, I found it. I found the cylinder. <laughs> <God damn it. laughs> and there's two of them, in fact. Wait, wait, wait. The cylinder? We're not looking for the cylinder. Sorry. We're looking for the cylinder. Dar, yeah, oh, 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 my mistake. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's my bad. A no, mistake, it, it's okay. it, it wasn't cylinder. It was just silly dar. I think it was just. Oh, it's silly end. dar. Ah, it's even di more different. Oh, oh God, is that a name? No. Yes. <laughs> I don't know. We're looking for his pet cat. <laughs> Kill <laughs> team, <laughs> report horrible, in. Horrible heretics. This is Captain Ericlades. We're aboard the ship. Yeah, it was Solidar. Yep. <laughs> We've avoided the Taco the, uh, Bell diarrhea. Encountered resistance from the Chaos Space Marines on board. They have destroyed a portion of the ship, I'm imagining with warp fire, in order to try and eliminate us. We've evaded it. And in another unknown sector of this ship. Inquisitor Magnus Blackthorn is typing. I bet he would leave us on red. I've recalled your transport! How dare you? No. Stay <laughs> there and okay. die, kill team. Stay there and die. <laughs> Probably because of the fleet is coming in. The Chaos Fleet. Re or reinforcement. You don't know how many fleet. Um. Let me know when you recover the artifact. I will send in another transport to extract the artifact. Understood. But not you. Just the artifact. <laughs> I'll have to send a third transport to get you specifically. <laughs> <laughs> and only you, not the rest of the KOT. <laughs> <sighs> I see. Do we go left or down? Don't bother thinking about coming back unless you secure it. Damn. Does anyone else dislike this Inquisitor? Make, make sure your comms is off when you say that. <laughs> <laughs> Abruptly I was going to ask if we could get, you know, a vague description of it other than Cylindar, but, you know. No, it, it was Cylindar without the N. He yeah. said you, you you can't mistake it. It would be I mean, indistinguishable. He said, I don't remember the description of it. Indistinguishable be, from a regular cylinder? Yeah, indistinguishable from a 55 gallon drum. Like this one. No. I'd imagine it'd be a <laughs> bit more unique than that. Quick, right. quick. Yeah, he, yeah, he, do you he, have he, any he, more he, of those mines? Slap them on the ends. That's unique. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys gonna literally do that? <laughs> just booby trap. 
a cylinder oh with God. mines and then blow up the Inquisitor. <laughs> Jesus. Are you guys so bad. That? No, uh, fuck no. 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 Hell that no. Was out of character. That would be character, like, yeah. holy shit. <laughs> Killing an Inquisitor. Oh, we'd be so fucked. Yeah. <laughs> My character would rather, I can't remember our first commander's ultramarine name, but he'd rather take that. Malachius. Yeah, my character would rather take the Malachius way out than do that. Yeah. Drop Did it go pilot. down or left? Probably left. Whoa, guys, it's totally me, the radical dropship pilot. I'm on my way already, because I totally like the fine orders of going early. We're in the pipe, five by five. Totally nowhere radical, to run, dude. Nowhere to hide. Make sure you do your awareness checks. Right? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, wait, I didn't do the uh, thing. 8.2! Mm -hmm. You see, I see all... all the everything in this hallway. This tiny, tiny, narrow hallway. Guilty, I was giving orders to take it to Space Hulk. I'll be a bad Inquisitor's orders. I may or may not land another hangar. Keep in mind, hangar B. Be aware, dropship was... pilot. There is warp fire on board this ship. Oh yeah. Uh, you might want to get your uh, sh your ship away from the derelict ship. Oh, do we have the schematics of the Space Hulk, by the way? No, it's a Space Hulk. Okay. Nope. It, it's like Roger 12, that, thousand team. ships smashed together. Okay. Roger that, kill team. Stand by for extraction. What? We're not being uh, extracted huh? yet. What? We're not being extracted. I'm warning him that there's warp fire in that section and he probably shouldn't land. Is what I meant to convey. I, I don't think this dropship pilot knows how to pilot a dropship. I hear you, kill team. But did he hear all of us say what? <laughs> it's like, what do you mean, stand by for extraction? Stand by for extraction. Okay, this dropship pilot's about to commit himself. What, what do you? I meant? see you. What? You're, that's not us. Uh oh, that's, that's not us. That's not a dropship pilot. Take cover. Karnov gets in combat <laughs> position. Oh, I, I jump behind true. these crates. Yeah, I'm gonna stand here. He's on your uh, behind your death watch squad channel, very secure. So, yeah, we've had warp oh. entities hijack those comms before, so I don't trust that shit. Oh, okay. Fair enough. You've already played this trick once before. I will not be fooled again. Wait, where did uh, Moth's character go? Over here, hiding. Oh, this I'm is taking what? cover. Excuse me, I'm taking cover. <clears throat> you mean you're running like a little bitch? No, <laughs> I'm not moving. I have my weapon out, and I'm ready to shoot anything. I'm in Overwatch. The dude said he was coming at us. Okay, we'll tell you what did you speech callers? Okay, we'll tell you we already told over. you that's not us, you idiots. Get no. out of there. <laughs> The dropship's gonna eat shit. It's gonna get blown up by chaos marines. <laughs> when did you switch colors? Contact the Inquisitor to get him to contact the dropship pilot. That's right. He said he'll send another dropship. I mean, fine. we can just kill team. When did you switch your armor to have spikes and skulls and chaos symbols everywhere? <laughs> Why are you suddenly orange and not black? Orange is the new black. Come on now. Oh, that's right, fair. Let's... That's fair. It's a That's fashion fair. statement. Yeah. Let's proceed. <laughs> He's a dead man. Uh, is uh, is this going to be renamed to an idiot dropship pilot? <laughs> he's being piloted Former by an Imperial idiot dropship guardsman. pilot because he's dead. He's being piloted uh, by an Imperial guardsman. Kill team, I'm out of fire. Stand by for a jump fire. <laughs> There's nothing down this tiny little corridor. Wait, dropships are an arm. They can't return fire. There is, fire. actually. There is a pathway there. Isn't it a Thunderhawk? Our Thunderhawk yep. had ammo. Yep. 
Thunderhawk. I was making a joke that dropships are unarmed. Oh. That seems silly to do it. Yeah, no, nothing down the hallway. Oh my god, a dropship is so stupid. Roger that, KOT. I'm landing in Hangar C. Meet you there. Right, so obviously he's getting comms from somebody else. Oh. Which means they've we're hacked also being our jammed. comms. And we're either being jammed, so we should probably switch channels. Agreed. <laughs> Roger that kill team, they were Chaos Marines, they met their maker. Over. <laughs> oh, it's incredible. Oh, he's a competent try. pilot, he actually yeah. killed. Wait, if they met their maker, contact. that means they met the Emperor. Oh. Well, right. they're not, they're heretics. Yeah. So these, these Space Marines, they're kind of like appearing down the hallway. You see them setting up barricades. You see the Dreadnought as well. Oh, uh -oh. fun. Stealth closer. Let's sneak in. Karnoff cracks his knuckles. <laughs> Audibly cracks knuckles through suit. Oh, are we gonna melee a dread that? Nice. I would certainly try. Oh, man. Okay, before you do that, I'm gonna reactivate the, uh, is that a second power. dreadnought? So, last fate point, we all get five toughness again. Five toughness. Sweet. That's oh, up. so, okay, so it adds to the, like, the armor points plus five? It adds or it to add? your, your toughness bonus for reducing armor. Or any other damage you would take. Anything that would affect damage and toughness bonus. So it, it's not calculated after... Like, so we have a toughness bonus, and then it's multiplied by three because of our unnatural toughness. And then that's plus our armor is the overall, like, armor. Yeah, the behind. bonus is multiplied by three, yeah. Yeah. So even the bonus, it, yep. Okay, good. It, it yep. would add plus five after the, the times three to the bonus. So it would just oh, be okay. five on top. Okay, okay so yeah. So just five on top of all of our armor. Here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Death Marine, get those acid grenades handy. <laughs> They were mine, oh, yeah. Sir. Also, take my final fate point to re-roll that silent move. <laughs> Yo, team, I'm getting a strange comms from the Inquisitor. I think he ate an apple or something. He's in his throat. I'm going to assume the comms are compromised. Stand by. I'll be at these coordinates. Oh, my God. He radios over the compromised comms. Oh, no, you guys get transmitted data. Uh, not by the channel. So you guys get those. Oh my fucking oh, god. Oh no. my god. <laughs> no. Get ready for a fight. I think I think you shook the entire ship. I trip and fall and uh... <laughs> you fall right on your face. <laughs> yeah. Right in the middle of the hallway. Oh no. That's fucking awful. Ate an apple or something. <laughs> it's oh my god. I wonder if it's his Adam's apple. <laughs> Gas Marines, you can suck a big fat one for compromising my comms. I like <laughs> to extend my finger and a salute to vast squad of Marines you sent to destroy this crap. <laughs> 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 oh my god, this dropship pilot. It's incredible. Well, it's even better with that voice, too. Calm right. yeah, it is. <laughs> Calms out. Oh man. Um, read a good stopping point. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. How many experience did we gain? Eight hundred for all that you went through. Actually, I'll give you a thousand. Cause that was like. Oh, all right. Yeah. 
I was trying to make it like apparent to you guys, like maybe you shouldn't follow the trail of mines these guys laid for you. They're doing to you what you did to them. Yeah. I mean, so, we, didn't do we planted a few mines. Oh, yeah, exactly. So no, you outflank them, you outmaneuver them, you set up a defensive position. They're they're as smart as you guys, so they're not gonna go charging into that. They're not. All right, hey, hey, excuse me. They're obviously not as smart as us. They're following chaos and not the God Emperor. So that's yeah, true. true. I'm saying tactically, they're as as capable. Well, we'd be dead if they were as capable. We've killed how many of them, and they've gotten zero of us. Well, right, they damaged me heavily. You're not dead yeah. though. It, it could have been probably. much worse if we, I wasn't in position. But yeah, I had to amputate my arm again. And yeah, I, he Tank. lost his arm. And and that was oh. your fault. How Wait, uh, does he that mean tell me that use... was my fault? Just that means you can't up use your boater. I didn't pick up a mine. Anymore. I fucking went to defuse it so it didn't blow up on anybody. Yeah, you defused it, and then you picked it up. Yeah. That's why I, I asked. Think... Oh. You, can, you, you can't shoot anymore. You don't have a hand. Isn't his plasma pistol... It's my pistol... left hand. I can still... Oh, plasma pistol's the, in the, the machine arm. Right. Oh. Yeah, it's true. It's no more plasma pistol. That thing kept no, overheating, no. giving me shit anyway. Sorry, so, Cooper, you have three arms. I thought it was in the, the big arm on your back. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's... it's. Uh... I misunderstood where you put that then. Where where did you put it? Your plasma? Where did it's you a literal it? pistol that I carry with me. Yeah, I thought I thought earlier you like integrated it into your servo arm uh, as like a welder attachment kind of thing. No, I uh, no, so. I was thinking no. He he just had it on him. No, he just, it's just a weapon. So he still has a pistol. Right. All right, sweet thousand XP. Next time we get to fight fucking dreadnoughts, it should be. Oh fun. hell yeah. yeah! Yeah. Oh god. I hope those acid mines do the trick. Yeah, we'll see. Well, they eat armor. They eat through armor. All that damage points goes straight to armor. Yeah. Like, destroys it. You've encountered stuff similar to that before. Right. Like the orc trap stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Sweet. I will... A little more... A, little, a lot more potent. <laughs> yeah. I will see you all next week. Alrighty. See ya. Peace. See ya.